Welcome everybody to the Street Fighter V Digital Havoc Tournament. We got some great fisticuffs coming through your way, but before we get to the play, we are joined with myself that is St. Cole, but who cares about that? Who are my other commentators that I have around me as a Partridge family? I think I'll, uh, I'll, 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 I'll we'll, we'll go first. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll, uh, I was going to say, I'll take the lead here then. Uh, I'm Flexus, everyone. Thank you guys so, so much for joining us. You already know when I'm on the mic, I bring the spice. I make it well-seasoned just the way you like it. Who do I got diagonally from me? Looks like Thomas might be frozen for a second. And Tom was a little. I know. It's like. That is Thomas Winkley. That's the homie yes. right there. You're trying to figure out stuff. You know, that happens with, uh, you know, you'll hear his beautiful voice in a second. Um, well, that's Thomas Winkley right there. And uh, we got Mufasa up there in the corner. <laughs> who's, who's muted? Am I am I actually muted? Am no, no you're good now. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? We're I'm all Mufasa good right III. here. One, one of the, the folks that uh, helps out and runs uh, Incendium. And, yeah, we're here with day uh, we're actually on week 48 of Digital Havoc. Oh my goodness. This is day two Ooh. for Street Fighter V. Uh, got a pretty stacked lineup tonight for our brackets. Uh, we actually already started some of our matches currently, uh, but we got some killers in here. Flux Waves is back again uh, this week. We also Ooh, got uh, Orphan Crippler. Uh, Dell's on fire as well, too. I'm sure he's pretty happy with his Ryu buffs that he got this uh, new season. Uh, we got a couple mm. other... <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about that one later. I'm sorry. I just, you know, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, we I had some ideas I didn't want to say. We'll talk about that later. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> yeah, well, we got him. Uh, Z's Nuts is back as well, too, along with Joe Ume Rogan as well. So, yeah, we got mm -hmm. some some Band solid favorites. players that are going to be here. Uh, yes, of course. Of course. Uh, but we're going to be starting up our first match very soon with Bumba Snuff and uh, Cocky. Oh, hell yeah. Bumba Snuff, let's go. You know I ride for this dog out here because the way that he plays Ken is... Mwah. Like, it's a mixture of this wild, not mild style, but he still's got the neutral. And any Ken that's playing that way is, is my kind of Ken. He's just my kind of dude. Let's see how he does right now. He's our first match of the night. Uh, you know, and Ken didn't get that many buffs. To the dismay of many Ken players, to the joy of other people out there that don't have... They don't want to fight a CFN Ken. So, but I still think he's not... A weak character like no characters in this game are weak but like i feel like he's still like still mid-tier he can still do damage he puts you in the corner it's gonna hurt and guess what you're gonna feel some love instead of hurt because it looks like thompson's back with us how you doing brother what's up Hold looks on, like no. he might Hold be on, figuring something not. out still real quick sounded like a google search Rupi, i'm not about these <laughs> ryu buffs because we'll get we'll, we'll get into it dell didn't need the didn't the, didn't deserve the buffs he's the exact reason why ryu <laughs> Ryu, sorry, does not deserve the buffs. In fact, he's not. He doesn't I'm have sorry, a Ryu. Are, he's a Ryu. He's a Ryu. He's Ryu. Yeah. We are call you him speaking Ryu just now. from the salt Ryu. when he steals your name, Sinkola? <laughs> he doesn't. He's unusual for doing that. He doesn't deserve the name. He doesn't deserve the monker at all. Even if he plays really well this this week, which he might with the nice buffs, he doesn't deserve it because the way he plays. We don't have to worry about him right now. Screw the Ryu, Ryu, all the ruse. We're getting to the kin. Thomas, do it with the zoom. <laughs> <laughs> Thomas with the with the Saint Cola. Let's go. <laughs> All right, getting into well, it right now. Yeah, we got the the Falk and the Ken pick. It's gonna be interesting, you know. Uh, Ken definitely doesn't have the worst projectiles in the world, so he can kind of find some ways in here. But Falk has some nice buffs this season too, so she's looking a lot stronger. Yeah, a lot more, you know, more beneficial stuff off our conversions and things like that. A lot more plus frames and a lot more of the ability to con convert, which is going to be really important. I feel like this season, as Art had said, she plays Street Fighter Five now, but Bubba Snuff, he's trying to play in the air, but down on the ground is where kan Kanuki is playing hard right here. This corner push looking real good. Is that name right? Activation is that time. Right? Kanuki? Is that what this is? Fox, how you say this name? Maybe with the, maybe with the nomenclature. What's the name? Which, which for this cocky? Are talking about? Cocky. Yeah. There we go. Cocky. cocky. My bad. I call him Kanuki. He got a little Kanuki. too cocky right there, as you saw right there. I don't know why I call him, but listen, he got a little too cocky because he got pieced up. Bumba stuff actually brought everything back. And just like that, the first one on the side of the king. Yeah, and a great like jump in Tatsu there going into and getting some damage on the board. He's gonna have to be able to keep this up though, because again, with those buffs, and, and you know, Falk has some great neutral play. We see that uh, ground projectile there too. Checks some good movement, so. 
I just think that his his willingness to disrupt things is actually putting uh, Kaki off. Like, it, it's really difficult to like get things going. The Bumba stuff's all over the place. Hatsu, the fireballs, things like that trading. Back to neutral, though. You have to control this character. He does not like that control. He loves the chaos. He's all about the chaos. Absolutely. And it is looking chaotic right now. Finally closes this gap, but it doesn't seem to last very long. Alrighty. Dashing in. And I see that V-Trigger on deck. He is looking to run in there. You gotta be careful, Max. This is finds the EX. Doesn't find the fears. Activation. Does it roll? I like that. Do at that max distance, so they can't do much about it. Catches the top of the dome shooters on the roof. Gotta finish off the job. You gotta double tap to make sure it's done like that. EX connects. Ooh. Corner push, side switch. Oh no. Ready with the anti-air. That round's gonna go to Kaki. Oh, wow. I like them, and again, having that control, the DPs and things like that, stopping a lot of the chaos and putting full control on the deck is what you have to do. And I feel like, again, this season, she's better off about doing that kind of thing. She can play Street Fighter V now, and that's a blessed way. But that fist, bless that face with a crush. EX connects. There's a reversal, the rebuttal. Woo, and some nice damage here. Going to do the DP ender, and that's giving him a lot of screen carry. He's got the corner advantage, but he's got to maintain it. Yeah, but he didn't oh, let... Here. He didn't let, he didn't get the combo, and now you're gonna let Kaki Shadinka live. Okay, but there's the bust out, here's the conversion. Big DP coming with the Tatsu Mini, baits it! Oh no! First one's That's gonna go to Bumba Snuff. Snuff. I don't know what he's yeah. sniffing, but it's got him acting unusual right here. It's got him going <laughs> a little bit wild. I don't know My what man's out here sniffing well, Bumba. He's, he's sniffing Bumba! She's sniffing the Bumba? It's in the name. Yeah, You're right, Tom. It's in the name. My man's sipping the bumba. His nose is face down in some bumba. What is bumba? Yo, uh, Chef, can I get an order of that bumba, please? On the side. Make you feel real unusual. Know, like... This is, again, why it's so strong, because you got to be chaotic in the neutral with Ken, right? Like, you're not going to have the most situated, you know, oh, perfect oh, gameplay, no. this character. That wrong kind of chaos right either. there. Yeah, yeah but, but beautiful, beautiful jump in. Fears. Ooh, getting a nice conversion here. But you don't fool me once, shame on you, fool me twice, shame on me. Out of the corner. Whoa. Oh, no finally Kaki lands a DP. Yo, anti-airs all day coming from Kaki Shinigo. Gonna take the plus. I like that view reversal, right? I don't want to deal with your toe stops. This time is the meaty. Not much of a punish. I think Kaki could have done more. Nice yeah, DP though, right here, you see back the control. Yo, right back at you, and does it roll? It's roll! You see him punching the meat in the background, it's roll! What are you, an idiot sandwich? sandwich. <laughs> Cross up, that was so Cross up. hopeless! Oh. Hockey out here, I, to be honest, he I, I feel like they're getting a little chaotic too. They're starting to swing out with the things. Yeah, coming into it again, a lot of damage coming from Bumba Snuff, but he has to continue to maintain his pressure, and he's gotta learn not to jump in because he's getting anti-aired, but seems to be doing all right right now. Ooh, that anti-air was great. The cross under throw into the corner, double crouching right. Yo, Bumba all Snuff, right. whatever he Bumba put up, the right nostril kicked in. <laughs> the right nostril came in the left. The left eight is potent right here, but he looking mad potent. Yes. Some of these jumpers happen tonight with the DPS, but Ooh. things like this they work out and getting the push, the oki, the pressure. It's it, the risk reward is in his favor right now. He is favorable in this matchup, almost for the stun, trying to get it done. Ooh, he interrupted. Oh, oh my Whoa. God, he he's just missed him. Him. He missed it twice. Oh my goodness, that's really unfortunate. Trade on the anti air, but again, finally landing that DP. You got to be careful jumping in here if you're Bumba Snuff. I like to be reverse land to get rid of her pressure. Do be right here, the fireball. Yeah, we over and release it. Over and release it. Sniper on the roof. Yo, that buff for the air fireball, definitely working out for cocky. It is just, and you, you see Bubba stuff. You, sometimes you get lost in the sauce. You get lost in the sauce a little bit, dog, and he got hit with the same stuff over and over again. Like, what's the definition of insanity, my friend? Bumper yep. stuff gotta gotta calm it down just a little bit, just a little bit, right? Because Kaki's out here sniffing what he's what he's putting down, right? He's like, oh, okay, hear about that kind of thing. Okay, I get you, I get you. And I like the control that Kaki's still putting on in terms of the pressure. And Bumper stuff not switching up the pressure. Kaki don't have to change too much. 
Yeah, the big thing is if you can let your opponent kill himself and make his own mistakes, then you already have the round itself. But man, trying to find a way out of here, not if Bumba Snuff oh. doesn't let you. Ooh, big punish. And you saw that series of Cocky trying to fight the way out of the corner. First the universal, nothing doing. Then mashing out the big EX, now getting clipped. And Bumba Snuff ought to be able to close this out with a lot of damage. That corner control again is how can that's how he wins. This is how I win. You put him in the put him in the corner and you just you you run the pressure game. Some of the best in the business in this game. He's the fifth member of the Backstreet Boys, right? He's out here being like, this is how we do it. Mm -hmm. You know. This is how we do it. It is Friday night. Oh no, it's not. See, time is time doesn't exist to me. It's almost, it's almost there. It's almost there. Somewhere it's Friday night. Yeah, but it's looking like Friday night right now because Kaki finds his way out of the corner. Definitely gonna be feeling comfortable too. Gets yeah, a lot of pressure here. Ooh. Also the fireball caught in the corner. Overhead connects. Ex DP. One more hit for the Just stun and gun. Just a hit away from the situation. Just needs to do it. He All right, activation time. Plate. Okay, the jumping medium punch, the range too. on that is so good. Yeah, I would say too, because Cocky has that full bar of meter, Bumbasnuff could potentially be one hit away from death if that confirm lands, but going in with the grab. And now, this is definitely one hit from death now, right? Like, big conversions here for Cocky. They get a jump, maybe two or three yeah. hits. Yeah, Ooh. if I'm him, I'd like to save that bar, but <gasps> desperate times, EXDP spins it, and he, I, that's what I'm talking about. Sometimes you have to hold that. You don't want to spin the bar, but if you don't spin, you're not going to get the win. Right here, Kalki trying to build that bar. So, with the fireball pressure right here, if you just stay back, hold back, you're fine. Oh, double KO! Oh. It's a double KO! That's going to work for Bumbus oh. Oh. Yep. Yo, he's still alive. Well, talk Never about a way to start KO. the Oh, man. I was going to say, talk about a way to start the back. tournament off. Yeah, really, really spicy. <laughs> Bumps not taking it, gonna be moving through the bracket yes, winner's yes. side. But very convincing uh, gameplay from Cocky, though. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Conv it it I was very convinced that Bumba stuff was definitely sniffing some stuff because that constant pressure, that constant, I'm getting in, I'm going to get that win, and that constant ability to be, like, stressing other person out, sometimes it's unfavorable as we saw some of the rounds kind of go down, but, like, he definitely had everything locked and loaded. I mean, when you when you have a Ken jumping in with that fierce to the face and you, you're you like, I got to, let me spin my, my meter here, here. He's like, no, nerd, no, nerd. I'm coming through with the Ken play. No, no, that's nerd. how Ken players get started, <laughs> right? You move stuff? into the suburbs, you tell somebody you're a Ken player, and they hand you the Scarface, right? They hand you a mirror, a razor blade, and an arcade stick, and they're like, welcome to the family. That's how this shit goes. That's how it goes. <laughs> oh, goodness. Listen, people, if you wanted, if you wanted the, 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 the eSports commentary, you're not going to get it here. You're going to get the fun stuff. It's a beautiful localized digital havoc, Street Fighter Five, And I know you love the action that we're putting on, and you're going to love what, we're gonna, what you're going to see later on. So let me hit you with the Miss Cleo, and why don't you just donate right now? Exclamation mark, Matcherino. Type it in the chat just like that. You can run the code, because I know in the future, because I can see in the future, you're going to love what you're going to see. So why don't you give some love right now? Let's get preemptively. If th that's a word, right? Preemptively? Listen, I haven't had a lot of sleep. Yeah. So preemptively. preemptively. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I said it right. We good. We good. You're good, you're good. Run that in the chat just like that. Get that, get that shit going, okay? Listen, words words are hard. Tom Tom knows. Mm -hmm. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you a line, brother. Words are hard. Words are hard. Words are, hard. <laughs> but the, Words are code, really hard. But you know what isn't hard? I was going to say, you know what isn't hard? Running that code and also doing the sponsorship quest on the right-hand side of the Matcherino page. Mm -hmm. as a little extra cushion to that nice price. Well, and of course, if you got a little extra in your pocket, you can definitely throw it our way. We will always appreciate it. Supports the players, supports the stream, and everyone in between. I'm, uh, I'm excited for the rest of these matches. Yeah, with the bar and just opened up, but how could you not be? How could you not be? Exactly. Mm -hmm. I'm actually more excited, less about like the players that are be coming up, but I've said this before, actually this week, like uh, that the fact that right now it's all clown shoes, people are like V-shipping at the wrong times, getting crush countered, mm -hmm. still sniffing out the changes and things like that. Uh, I'm more excited to see people just just fall on their face as they try to learn the new meta because this is one of the best times to watch the game everyone's 
No one knows what yep. to do in full. No one knows who's the, the strongest characters. We know who the strongest characters are. We have at least an idea, but we don't know how things are going to change with the V-shift system and stuff like that. So it's just people just mm -hmm. V-shifting in the corner, getting crush countered, and right. me smiling as they are eating that salt. I love this time. This is my favorite time. Yeah, <laughs> yeah this is the like the week two favorite You're time. You're a villain. Right? Like, oh. <laughs> oh, yes. You can just I'm here. You're a villain. You he's know like, what? No, that's why I'm here. No, that's why I'm commentating. He's like, he's like, He's like a brand safe villain, right? He's he's definitely a villain, but he's not gonna throw you in. Oh my god! Speaking of villains, we got Dells just... on fire versus Shadow Age. Oh, Lord. <laughs> you took the words right out of my mouth, Tom. We've got the Ed. I love this new Ed costume, by the way. It is so freaking cute. I am a big oh, fan, Lord. but yeah, we got the Ed versus the Ryu. Ryu. Uh, I'm trying to think of other ways to pronounce Ryu just to break it. Ru. Oh, button check maybe. <laughs> <That's> Ru. Ru. <laughs> Ru. <laughs> Ruru, the Ruru, Ruru, Rusi out here. Let's see what uh, Del's <laughs> on fire does. Looks like maybe uh... right, they're back in it. I All guess right. Uber East was at the door. <laughs> oh, he Ooh, you the pair! That was nice. Ooh, oh, he's you keeping you level three. Max distance too. Get a little of that V bar too. Yeah, we're gonna see a we're gonna see a lot more sweep, right? With that being seven frames, we got the guy. Yo, the neutral jump, the throw bait. Tatsu coming? Oh yeah. That's gonna be sun right there, baby. Going in with a big jump in damage, but not able to finish his plate. Activation time for Shadow Ace. Oh. Yeah, a few drops here, maybe for a reset, I'm not sure, but still, Delzon in a prime position to take this. One good EX fireball, one bad fireball from, from Shadow Ace. On the other hand, too, gotta be careful what you throw out either side. Yep, and Delz is happy, right? 37 yeah. seconds on the clock, we chilling. He could go for the chip. At this point, you're no, just done. I, you know, you could, but in this situation, like you, and you could probably build the bar in the round two or three. But it's good that you, you kind of have to force them. The, the time makes them come to you, and you're forced to come to them, and they have to get the job done. And that deficit makes it even harder. But here we go, Shadow Ace fighting back just like that. Gets the ex set up time. You should jump parry though. Oh, the parry and break on the throw, that was life or death there for a second for Shadow Ace, but manages to find his way out of it. But Dell's trying to jump up, V-Ships get caught by the Snatcher, speaking of clown shoes, oh, Benny no. Hill music's playing bad DP, CA, this is gonna be a dead guy. This <laughs> 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 B shifted in the corner, but Shadow Ace had something ready for him. He said, if you do this thing, I'm gonna do that thing, and that thing gonna hurt your thing. And I like that, having that do that B skill, it seems like one of the smart options if you have that right distance to kind of catch them going back, but just like that, Del's on fire trying to come in. Never mind, commentator's curse. Shadow Ace swinging his fist through. Look at that, yeah, he pushed Roundhouse and check. then swept. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go ahead, Flex. <laughs> oh, no worries there. Missing the grab, but... I like, you know, it, it's really interesting the fireball gameplay that's going on here because Shadow Ace is really trying to use his projectile to close in this distance. But again, d with that parry option for the V skill, I think this is making his gameplay a lot harder and it's making Shadow Ace think a lot more on how he's going to, you know, do his approach. Has got a lot more damage on the deck. Avoids the B trigger, oh. try to get the neutral jump, still able to cancel. And this is big boy damage if he can land it, but he has to be able to land it. Small hand too. Well, I'm not sure what that was. Maybe he might have been going for the V trigger for the juggle and he hit V skill yeah. instead. Yo, Yo that's gonna be a big, a big boy damage. Parry. Went for the okay. Dell's going with the hard reach with the, the big donkey kick after the parry thing and Shadow Ace was gonna dash behind that fireball. The big brain stuff. Not working out. What? It was it I mean any other any other Ryu player. Maybe. Dell's on fire. I feel like he's watching the stream and listening to us, and he wants my reaction. That's he definitely. <laughs> I, I, I think he's doing this on purpose. No, I'm just kidding. But anyway, you know, I feel like he's just he's these minute decisions away from taking these rounds or, or you know closing things out, right? And the fireball game is in favor of Ryu. Like this is definitely this character's uh, time to zone, right? Like this is perfectly fine. But at the same time, he's taking a lot of damage in the middle in the beginning of the round where you don't need to be doing that. Wow. Yeah, and it almost looks like he's like I, experimenting with this match a little bit. 
or he's maybe just unsure, right? Because he's trying to parry the Snatcher. He's working on Fireball classes. But just like that, a Fireball comes out. Big jump in from Shadow Ace. And look at that, Delos just chucks a Fireball on the block string. Okay, there's a punish. Yeah, the V-Shift out of there, great use of it. And, and that's the thing I appreciate, the V-Shift is an awesome tool when you're in the neutral because you have so much space to kind of play with. In the corner, we saw earlier Dells got pretty heavily punished, but activation time and goodbye orb. There's a the throw. Yeah, Dells has great positioning here. Oh, he missed Ooh. the second parry. Missed? Yeah. Got a parry twice for that. I, he's been doing it this entire time. But still cleans it up, you know, at the same time, sometimes you just make mentally prepared to do the second one. It's like, well, there's another hit to it. And he's trying to parry a lot of stuff, trying to parry the fireballs, thinking that he Daigo out here. He's just gonna be Daigo fire out here. Ah, uh, here we go, Never mind. he heard my cries. Okay, okay, you kinda looking nice. Shut me up here, fire, shut me up. Yo, he parried he's again. Okay. He's like, why are you getting robotic with these block streaks? The neutral jump chases down. One more touch, there's a DP coming. He waits, stuns. Bop, bop, dead. No, oh, you, 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 you missed it! Oh, the no, man no, did not clean up his place. He went for seconds and everything, and it just... That's unfortunate. He, you don't make sense, but you... Again! <laughs> he just did it again! Just raw DP! You know Dells <laughs> you know doesn't cook anything. Like, he doesn't cook anything. Fire, man. He loves to play with fire. Hence the name. He's but... like, yo, I, I love a steak. Cast iron skillet? Nah. Frying pan, five seconds, both sides take it out. I'm done. Shit's raw. You know when you, like, oh, hear me out, hear me out. You know when oh. you eat a lot of food, and then you're oh, like, yeah. okay, I'm really full. I don't think I can eat anymore. And then you go and you go for your, like, mid-meal poop. And then you come back, you're like, I have so much room for more. I feel like that was Bell's just now. You clean, you clean. That was Bell's oh, just now. Bell. He's like, hold on, hold on. The I gotta Bell's... go for my mid-meal poop. Now I got enough room to finish this match off. That's the, <laughs> the, Look at the, That's the best one right there. You clean that sucker yeah. out. <laughs> Just like my man's getting cleaned out with a jump <laughs> right here. Bless the dome. Activation, keeping the plus frames on. And that got blocked. He forgot about the last hit. There you go to do it right here. Ace, a lot of push off the flicker. Damn, mid, 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 mid buffet poop. I didn't. I thought I was the only one. <laughs> <laughs> friends all over the world. Let's go. Yo, yo, he tried to move forward, got caught with the flicker. He's gonna raw activate. Walks into the corner, gonna take the conversion there. Gotta be careful, Dells has a lot of damage on deck. Doesn't even need it. Spends two bars. Says, not this hey, time. You gotta really no mid-meal sure. poop, I'm finishing yeah. the meal. Put <laughs> the plate with me in the, in the bathroom. I'm gonna I'm a double, I'm gonna double task. I'm a fish. <laughs> he's, in like a fancy, like, he's in like a fancy restaurant and the dude that hands you the towels, he's like, could you roll my plate for a second? I gotta roll my sleeves up. Oh that would definitely be Dells right here. The way he plays is definitely yep. disrespectful. <laughs> DP again. This is what I'm talking about. That's the type of dude. Yo, hand me the plate. I'll take it in full course meal. I'll do it in the bathroom. Oh. Crush. Yo, <laughs> she's from <laughs> trouble. The sweep and the Swimming activation. Again. It is time, but he's V reversal and out of there. Shadow Ace looking to live for another day. For how long? Dells just needs. I feel like one good conversion. That bless crushing mini kick, but. Shadow Ace, pull him closer, turns off the EX, double time it. Great defense from Shadow Ace, not getting opened up. Yo, my man's trying to style, I bet. Well, he is. Yeah, he's, he, he's fishing for something. Uh, that, oh, he's just really cross me to kick into the conversion of the V trigger. Okay, Del. Mm. Okay, Del. Okay, you that can't have my it. name, but that was sick. But that was sick. All right, that Del, I see you. Damn. My eyes are I'm on you right now. My eyes are on you. Mufasa's right. like, listen, I've yeah, watched this guy too much. I know he's trying to style. <laughs> listen, some, a lot of times it somehow works out for him, and there's times where he gets blown up, and it's just that those are the most hilarious parts about watching him play. Yeah. Hold on now, French. It, uh, hold on now. He doesn't get my name. Well, not just yet. Not just, maybe if he wins the tournament. Maybe if he wins it. I'll let him have my name for a match next time. But that was a great <laughs> match in general. You saw Dell. Styling and wiling out here. Many wake up DP situations probably to you know yeah. blow up the throws, which are risky, but still you know not the worst idea when you have a lead. And also just in general dealing with a lot of the uh, the V skills that we saw, pairing a lot of that stuff. And the fireball game got a lot better as things progressed too, which is as weakness. And you didn't see a V skill switch, so no big deal. Stall the Hadoukens all damn day.
So we're just getting an update right now. We're waiting for one match between Joe and Rogan, Rogan and uh, Madness. So whoever that wins that, they're going to be playing on stream next versus Lizard Man. Ooh. Ooh Yo, the homie Lizard Man, one. the best B skill two user. <laughs> Nobody else out here doing it, but he's doing it. Okay, I feel like he convinced gotcha to do it. I feel like he is the one who did it. So we just got an update. Joe, Joe actually did win. So we're going to have him up next on stream versus Lizard Man. Joe versus the Now, a little bit of a, I was going to say, now, Joe Moroccan, he played in the G Fuel, uh, well, he qualified and played in the G Fuel tournament that was, uh, what was it, like, last week, and yeah. he he did very decent, like, he definitely took home a couple W's, you know, definitely not yeah. anyone to scoff at, so it's going to be a tough competitor, you know, obviously, Lizardman, time and time again, placing up in, I would say, top eight very comfortably, uh, for Digital Havoc, mm -hmm. so it's going to be a good match. I'm very excited to see it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I feel like um, I'm excited to see the chaos, the just the the wild style that that Lizard Man loves to do. But there's a yeah. there's a method to his chaos. I mean, uh, you know, we we just talked about uh, Umi Rogan, but Lizard Man also has made some top eights elsewhere. NLBC, same as Umi Rogan, but he made some top eights in you know the online local when he's played there before. So mm -hmm. also you know gonna give you some of that great action some of these pool matches you know otherwise would be just kind of you know just some you know people maybe on the weaker side of things but i like that the the way that things have progressed for the for this game at least in this scene and in this tournament you see a lot of great matches right off the bat like it's not a lot of snoozers it's not a lot of people who are just you know hey, speak up the game which is fine but you're gonna see a lot of great action all the way through that people that you would see typically top eights top four top fives of stack yep, online yeah. tournaments that we've been having recently and Proofs in the pudding. You guys can right. look back at the, the receipts on that one. I'm not lying to you. And we meme on Lizardman a lot, right? Like, we we always have, like, the Lizardman jokes, right? And I feel like anytime he's on screen, mm -hmm. we're always like, oh, the Lizardman, the lizard brain. But, like, there's a <laughs> method to the madness of Lizardman. And he's actually a really solid player that has developed a style that he can control the speed and pacing of the match with. And, and clearly it works for him because, like you said, we see him in top 16s, top 8s all the time. Tons of different brackets, tons of different mm -hmm. places. He knows what he's doing. So, yeah, sure, he does stuff that's a little wild, but it, it pans out and it pays out because there is actually a strategy there. There's ideology there, and there's a system there that works out really well. So, I wonder how the nerfs of the V-Skill 2, which he was upset about, are going to impact mm -hmm. this match because he's one of the types that is maybe not the most optimal thing to go for V-Skill 2 compared to V-Skill 1 in a Fireball-type right. matchup, but he's 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 willing to run something that he just enjoys, right? Which isn't gonna kill him for, you know, maybe sometimes it might, you know, put him in you know, some unfortunate, unusual situations. But I, you know, I'm curious to see how it's gonna operate in, in in the Akuma matchup. And this is not a matchup I've seen in this meta recently a lot. A lot of Akuma yeah. players have kind of stepped to the side, went to the the path of the Hado, like and left the side of the sauce. We didn't know Hado, but I still think Akuma's strong. I still think Akuma might be in the top tier spot. He is in the top oh, tier for sure. spot. He's still, oh, okay. He's still a good character. I'm not gonna downplay this character. Fuck that. Yeah. That character is and, and, and mad like, good. Don't let anybody tell you different. Yeah. Round one. I would say, and like the the changes Mark. too to both these characters. Well, I mean, really, the changes in the roster in general. Like, I don't think anybody was horribly nerfed, or I, I should say, some people were definitely buffed when they shouldn't be. But I don't think anybody was too terribly nerfed. But man, Joe Morogan right now making it look like Akuma was nerfed with that tattoo in the face. Mm -hmm. You gotta confirm those. Yeah, and you. Yeah. Speaking of something you saw matchup specific, you already saw a V skill get hit by Joe and Marugan with an anti air, and Joe did not take advantage of the extra juggle frames. So that's something we're gonna have to see later on, to to basically convince Lizardman not to abuse this V skill too. Yeah, that is a change, isn't it? Like if you were up in the skies, Ooh. you'll get hit and hurt. Mm -hmm. But speaking of up in the skies, Lizardman took him up the skies oh. again and did the finish off the combo. Gotta get it done, but the bad yeah. overhead's gonna set him back and just like that. There's a DP. In the Go Retsuha, I'm gonna go see you in the next round. And that's fine for Akuma to spin that bar because he's gonna get back in the second or third. Yep. Yeah, I absolutely respect the optimization there, right? Like, yeah, it was an expensive win, but you don't leave Rashid alive. Absolutely not, because Rashid has a huge comeback factor already. We see it here, a lot of damage being put on the board, but misses the throw, gonna get a good punish for it from Joe. Yo, okay, down fierce, throws out the, the uh, tornado. I forgot how spinning wind works for a second. Gonna go over the top with the V-Skill 2 and just putting the pressure. Luma Rogan not finding times to bust out. There it is, EXDP, gonna try to find something to do it now. Wakes up a little low. 
How come? Back throw, crush, hold this. Yo, the setup, side switch with the B shift, saving his hide Smart. for a second. But needs one more confirm. Either person. Oh, he crashes on the DP out of the crowd. Oh, oh the throw. This is on the oh, throw. Oh. Immaculate. He just Puma. stood there. He, he just him. knew that that throw wasn't going to reach. He just stood there. That's the stay sucker free right there. That's a stay sucker free. Mm. I, that's like a mini mix right there. I, if, you, if you try to move, I'm going to get you. Damn, Umi Rogan mm -hmm. kind of calming down, man, like oh, Lizard Man no. out here. Got a few more wrinkles right. in the brain. But I'm, I'm trying to see Lizard Man smooth it out just a little bit more. Takes a turn, going for the D-Skill too. Look at these short ranges, trying to bait something, and maybe an anti-air. The air-to-air, -air, but the dive doesn't catch. Umar Rogan looking comfortable, looking stable. Yo, Furby with yeah, the big raid, thank trigger. you, brother. Yes, much love to NYC Furby. Shout out to them. Welcome, everybody, to the stream. You may now be seated. Enjoy some Street Fighter V action. We are serving, because right now, Liz has been putting some damage on the board, trying to even up the life bar. And he's got that meter, but I know Joe has B trigger on deck. He's looking. There's the activation. I like that sweep right there. Got off the toes. Double down with the fireball. DP should do it. Umi Rogan on set point with the quickness. And you see Lizard Man was catching him with a lot of stuff, but the damage that this character does is not the same differential as Akuma out here. Yeah, you absolutely right there. Okay, yo, this time the DP bait works out. Lizard Man gonna get the corner carry of this combo for one bar. Look at the juggles. The man looking like a clown out here with them juggles, especially because he got hit with that cross up. Joe Morogan finding his way out of the corner, got the throw. The X connects again. Extended damage on the B skill allows him to do it with the wake up EX DP. Ubi Rogan not taking a damn thing. Oh. Back down on the ground, you go with the heavy wake up DP though. Try to meet him in the skies. No surprise when they had the double fireball. Back throw. Yo, we cheat for the knock dash. That will not stop Crouch Lizardman fears. from pressing Fire buttons. Around. Does not matter. Crouch fears. I'm swinging my fist, and if you come in the space and you get hit, it's your own fault. You get hit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Ooh, like this, like that this. was interesting. Yeah. yeah. The wall dive, that was really interesting, the angle that that came in. I, I think it would have been really hard there for Joe to guess it, but again, got the corner. Oh. Said it a little too. Did y'all see the down fierce? Did you see the down fierce combo? Did y'all see that? That's done. Oh my you god, god the tech. I would have got god. Uh oh! Bottom hit with the counters! A lot of them. Uh uh. Okay, here's the Go question the bust out or not? Goes low! Here's the bust out. Yo, oh, oh, lizard, man, you genius. Goes out the beach on the other oh, side. Oh, I was behind oh, you the whole entire oh. time. Hit him with the Nani, the Nani. Rashid I was behind the entire time. Nani? Evening <laughs> sings up for Lizardman right there. That was such, I, you know, that's the thing that I appreciate about this V-Trigger for Rashid is the kind of cross, like cross-up setups you can create is so cheeky Round and one. so just stupid. Fight. You love to see it. Like you have got to have an good. iron defense to be able to block some of that. Yeah, let's get out of the corner, and we've seen him like spin the bar to get out of the corner too as well. Or I've seen him spin the bar for V reversal, so he's alternating how he uses the V bar in general. V reversal or V trigger. One man get triggered down to the ground, yep. wakes up, gets hit, put back to sleep. Yo, here comes the rock right, from action. Lizardman, gonna bounce off, gonna keep going, gonna run and throw. Actually, for Joe, just taking the throw is not too bad. Tries for the air to air though, and the fireball stops the V skill too. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, oh. getting caught with a DP. Talk about a great answer. Got, I like the Tatsu 2 for the side switch. Jumping, not the not, but the forward. medium kick applied. Umi Rogan on set point. He's starting to calm down the V skill shenanigans and saying, wait a minute. What if I thought fireballs here? Because you can throw fireballs in a better way. Nice whip punch round start. He's the medium kick again. Yo, the air to air with the jump light punch. Goes with that six frame back fierce, nothing but the buffer stand, medium kick gonna convert. Uma Rogan is really putting some good pressure, but then again, we see amazing anti arch from Lizardman. The 
the dive kick, dive kick in. Pizza? Yeah. That option is really good to beat a lot of what Rashid wants to do, especially the season where Crouching Game Punch has been nerfed previous seasons and he doesn't really have the best anti-airs. Gotta get predictive with it. Lizard man, gotta be careful. Here's the activation, and you know what's one good confirm away for the play. Look! Lizard Lizardman is getting hit with 100% oh, no, of go. these instant air fireballs. Akuma yes. wins. Took it with the throw. Joe Morogan gonna be moving on. And pretty, you know, there was definitely a lot of back and forth there. Um, Lizardman a couple times looked like he was going to take it and, put, and he put a lot of damage on the board. But yeah, Umarogan going to be moving on, securing his spot over in top eight. But uh, Lizardman not down out for the count just yet, just hopping down into Loser's side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, our, next out of the place. Match, our next match we're going to have uh, on stream is going to be Axio versus Dell's on fire uh, again. <laughs> so let's My see man Axio's in uh, here? Axio's in here, yes. So that's going to be playing up Axio. against Delzon right now. You you want biased commentary? You're about to get it. I'm all Mika for this match. <laughs> My man Axio showing up to tournaments. He doesn't even play Mika anymore. He's a Lucia main. I don't even know who he plays. I'm going to be going crazy. Also, I want to point out that Del's on fire. Not Del's on fire. My God. Joe Morogan hit Lizardman with like yeah. 400 million air fireballs. Like the, the close-up walk forward air fireball was blowing up Lizardman. Mm -hmm. That's all. Yeah, yeah the difficulty is, you know, you can't really toss up fireballs with a V-Skill like that. Like, I mean, you can't use the V-Skill mm -hmm. with the fireballs out on the screen. It's going to be checked. Like, when you're trying to come down, the fireballs rule on the screen. We have a way over the fireballs unless you're really predictive with it. you got to get really in that minutiae area. And with Akuma's great walk back and forth speed, my man can just smooth and groove and get that bad positioning. But let's move and groove on to the next match here. Axion versus Dell's on fire. Yo, Lucia. Axio. Rock. It really is a Lucia a pink. He's he really plays Ooh. Lucia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Round one. Let's go, Axio. Fight. Even though Lucia got Hit him with some the love, uh, I mean, as I say, got some love here too in the season. I still think she's kind of at a, a difficult spot, and it's going to be interesting to see how she can handle these Ryu buffs. Obviously, Ryu becoming a little more well-rounded character, a lot more damage. Um, and just overall better neutral oh. tools, but right now, Axio very convincingly getting a lot of damage with the stun. Yeah, and I'm, I'm actually oh, interested to see how this match plays out because this match happens a lot in the online local pre-tournament lobby. He knew the parry was coming. He throws the man. Axio takes the round. But these two play a ton, right? So it's interesting to see just how it will work out in tournament instead of in just like a casual, we're all drinking. Hmm. Dell's on fire with the DP. This is what you have to win right here is the fireball game where she feels mad on using it. Ryu's fireball game is going to help out. Nice EX DP, able to bust out at that max distance. Dell's on fire. So there's more of these fireballs. Sweet. Ooh. Yo, he gets him in the air, gets the juggle, does Axio? Uh oh. Yeah, but he's going to get the wall bounce there. Nice DP ender, but activation time for Axio. He's trying to keep the pressure going, though. He could get one or two hits and put Dells on the back foot really easily. All he has to do is just keep the zoning game. There's not much you can do from this distance. He's got to spin bar and has a side on through, but he denies that the DMs are closed. I'm seeing somebody. They're closed. That was, that was actually six pages from Dell. Saw that it was going to whiff. Got him with the low forward whiff punish. That was really clean. And then this is you can't yeah, really do nice much. Little... You have to slide on through. You do the fireballs. You, that's, you, yeah. You, you, so like, what else could that come? You know, what could come from that distance? I mean. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's really hard because Lucia has a slower startup with her fireballs too. So trying to get that game plan started can be really hard to struggle there for Axio. But sweep in activation. Oh no! Big punish time. That's a lot of damage for a whiff DX. Yeah, <laughs> that's one of those like, we just got Beatrix, this dude hits like a truck, nice punish after the parry, didn't have anything else behind him. Those are the fireball connects, not enough to do it. Axio could still take this. He's got a bar at the bottom, and then Beatrix, she has some little bit of enhanced Woo! damage. Falls the follow, yeah! the follow up, oh Axio, God, but no. gets caught with the God, DB on the wake up. With the raw stuff. For you. Tom, huh? I know this hurts you, doesn't it? Oh, God. My heart. You okay, Tom? My heart. You okay, Tom? That GP went straight to my heart! <laughs> Uncooked, unseasoned, unslathered or lathered in any sauce, just does it raw. But it, the, the patrons are happy, it doesn't come back to the kitchen, and it sends him with the first win.
let's be real too. Like medium punch, wake up DP in that situation is like the most Dells on fire thing in this match. Good jump in to start up over the fireball. Already has actually a lock in the corner. Ooh, and a great anti here too. Keep him locked down. The V reversal though finds his way out there, but not for long. Back in the corner he goes. Dude, he tried not working out. Actually... Why is he doing that? He's Even he said in the chat, future idiot though, but this is Dells, this is Dells. Yo, yo, busting out his axe. Yo, yo, don't you talk to it me, I'll talk to it you. E reversal. Put him back. Like He's in that offensive kind of style thing. Like it's over the crouching mini kick. The six frame are coming through in the clutch. Those are the EX that will connect. Dell on set point. Honestly, he's been making mistakes where I feel like maybe other characters could punch a lot harder, but Lucia doesn't have the damage unless she's in V-Trigger. So you see a lot of things not go for free, but not go punished, like fully. Yo, shots to Buffalo also for the raid. Coming through the 14, we see you. Oh no, talk about big punish, by the way. Again, too, you mentioned this before, you know, it, it feels like it's gonna be a lot of damage, but it really isn't because Lucia does not hit that hard. Back in the corner, Axio finds himself. He's going to have to get a way out of here. Yeah, one good crush me kick conversion. Looking for the burn kick. Doesn't get it. Dell's on fire. Again, throw out the fireballs from Ryu. And just throw out the sweeps, too. They're all connecting. And he's got the ability to V-trigger, but the wait and bait. There's the bite. Reel it in. What's on the other end? It's damage. Now with the activation, the follow-ups. Okay, now let's Ooh, the shift. The v shift. Crush, EXDB oh, follow up. No. One more hit to do it. It is one hit either way. But that was definitely looking. Wow, that fireball went oh. right <laughs> underneath. Yeah. Dells was like, listen, I'll play fireball games all day. That's why I picked Ryu. And Axio, I love you, but you got God. But I still love you. You got God. <laughs> Anyone's gonna get God, I feel like, in that matchup on, on paper, because again, the firewall pressure is so hard for Lucia to deal with. Ryu being buffed this season means big boy damage compared to hers, where she does have damage extension. Uh, well, that was kind of buffed, but not enough, as you saw right there. So every punish that kind of went, you know, that, that, that guy actually got punished, it wasn't enough. It wasn't enough for Lucia. And you still kind of see the, the weakness of that character, but that was on coming through again. A lot of. Dell's on type play, but again, it worked out. You know, we sent it off to the customers. The patrons loved it. It didn't look yep. too good, but they ate it. So, you know, like the whole product team stood around and was like, "Are we really going to ship this? Are we gonna? Are we gonna ship this?" <laughs> and they're like, "Yeah, we gonna ship it." This, and then the reviews this... came in and they were like, five stars, fantissimo, yes, bravo!" And they were like, "Oh fuck, I guess we shipped it." I love you, Dells. Yeah, this is You're this is what genius. I wanted to, to order. Yeah, this is good. <laughs> so our no, next match on the bracket, have, we're gonna have Bumba Snuff versus Joe Ume Rogan for winter semis. Ooh. Yes. Yo, speaking of up the right nostril, Bumba Snuff versus Rogan. <laughs> Damn. And then after that, we're gonna have Flux Waves and Dells on fire <laughs> after this match. So all four Ooh, of these players are gonna, gonna be, be fighting one. for. Yeah, that will be. Uh, all four players are going to be playing uh, to get into winner's finals, so I'll be nice. Yeah. Oh, okay. And what do we want? Okay. A prize worth fighting for. And in order to get that Mulan theme prize, we really need to step our game up and get onto that match arena, right? So what y'all need to do for me mm -hmm. is an exclamation point match arena here in the chat. Click that link and drop that code DH48GG. So that no, actually, SF we can... uh, V. SFV, actually. Ah, uh, SFV. Code. Thank you. I, yeah. I can't read. So you could go give the, the Guilty Gear, I was going to say, you could go give the Guilty Gear players some love as well. If you want to hit up both match arenas, definitely would appreciate it. Yeah. Of course. But do it. Do the steps. I'll Everyone be honest, I had, I had Mulan music playing in my head the whole time. Like in the back of my mind after I said that, I was just like, <laughs> let's get down to business to give players the funds. That, that's all that was happening. Wow. After. I couldn't. Damn. You know. That's you know it's totally you know what it's with the you see with the song bars. Let's go. Yo, Yo, if, if, I know you love Tom's bars. Let's go. Run the run the Maturino. Oh. Run the Maturino. Also tweet this out. Let the people know what's going on. There's a hundred <laughs> of you coming through. I love to see not only run that Maturino, but put on the Twitters, the Facebooks, the MySpaces, mm -hmm. the live journals, the Zangas, the i channels.
and things like that. Catch it like that. Put it to the people that know what's going on. People, tell me who you love. Because I see Rogan fans up in the chat. Do we do we got any Bumba stuff fans up in the chat? Do we have any kid fans coming through? Do we have anybody coming through for the, the hot foot? I don't, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. <laughs> I'm that still saying the, like, the Mulan song the in feet. my head, but then I'm like... Because <laughs> yep. yep. I'm like going off of what you're saying. I'm like, did they send me tells on when I asked for none? <laughs> <laughs> no! no. Yo, Flex, Girl, that is the best that, neutral we've ever got. But Delza doesn't have a clue. They got you on the screen right yes. now. Ubi Rogan switching to the view. But he just stood there and got jumped around by Bumbasnuff. Look at this. He's just standing and trying to challenge something. Sometimes you feel like when you have a lot of health to play with and you're not playing Akuma, like, oh, I can take these hits because I'll get the trigger. I'm just assuming. I'm just making up a lore here because yep. I don't know why you're doing that. <laughs> I mean, it's working out. Big life lead, got some conversions. Winning the fireball game, the low forward underneath, but the donkey kick not connecting. The Jotun Bushongari not getting in there. The run pressure, again, a low forward. That buff coming through clutch, the V trigger conversion. Rogan in for round one. Yeah, very convincingly Ryu. at that, you know, lot. and again, we're seeing these Ryu buffs in action, making him look like a very strong player and definitely putting in a lot of damage. Got the throw, walking bum with snuff into the corner. Yo, like this is nice at the right moment. He's just challenging all the dashes and things like that, checking all these jumpings like that with the DP to do it. Things like this are starting to add up in his favor, and he's getting closer to that trigger situation where we've seen a lot of damage come from his character. Yeah, there's that sweep activate though, using the seven framer. Air to air, gonna side switch. Doesn't get the hit, but still, then corners himself. I was just about to talk about how the positioning was so smart. EX fireball out, walking forward. Activation though for Bumba Snuff. It's time to hold some Bumba pressure. Was Bumba throw? Oh One more though. Ooh, and a Bumba anti air to fears. close out the round. <laughs> you think he, like, he's gonna pat pitting out after this? He's gonna be like, oh, sure. don't get this bumble gump right here. He's gonna make some, gonna make some go or some shit like that. Crush though! Break the glass, take him on the other side. The weight in the bait! Yo, I like that he used that juggle the side switch. Gonna punish. One more touch is gonna stun. Overhead or low goes low. One, two, three. Bubba gum shrimp for me. That's a perfect, ladies and gentlemen. Bumba snuff takes game one. Can win. <laughs> Such strong stuff. You, you can see, like, Umi Rogan, you know, maybe not ready for the, the Bumba stuff. A little bit too much to sniff. You know, sniff a little bit more than he could do. Uh, still too much more than he could do. I don't know why. Okay, I'm, 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 I'm going to get in trouble for what I'm saying here. Oh, maybe. I was going to say, though, Bumba snuff bringing the Bumba stuff right now. Going back into character switch. I wonder if we're going to see Joe Morogan bring out the Akuma. You know, maybe the Ryu wasn't the best option here. Uh, I think Akuma has some better tool sets to handle yeah. some against pressure, especially with the air fireballs. But, you know, it is Bumba Snuff we're talking about. Yeah, and uh, I don't Which think Bumba Snuff really uh, looks bad at all, right? Yeah, but I, I definitely like, going to have a more polished the, the, Akuma. Oh! Exactly, oh. years upon years. The re maybe not, not until like recently, every other. 75 people out there that they're now Ryu players now going back mm -hmm. to the main man that is Akuma who is like like y'all said super strong still you just can't mess up as much the tools are all there you got to be able to use them up. right and there are some new things to the matchup right like I was watching a tech video today there is an 18 frame gap in between his forward fierce target combo so you can now interrupt in between that or v-shift it like there's stuff you can do so mm-hmm Mm, look at that yeah, anti-air though, great six anti frames, he needs it. Yeah. <laughs> Mumba Snuff in the corner, got the fireball, but misses a little bit of a throw activation time. Ooh. Oh, that was... Uh, so we out of there like that cross cut? Yeah, I, I, I got hit. Y'all at home got hit. Interrupts the overhead. EX, DP, one more hit to do it. You gotta finish off your plate. Jump in, fireball pressure right here. You don't have to overextend. You can play this nice mid range where Ken kind of suffers at. His fireballs, you know, compared to other characters, maybe not the best. And you can just kind of play this nice crouch to kick range, throw it up, but to interrupt it just like that. Just like that. Call yep. me Miss Cleo, call me now. He interrupts the fireball to crouch to kick 
and that'll do it right here for the first one. For Jolton, we all get finally get something on the board. But Bumbusnuff isn't slowing down the pace, right? Still dashing, getting his jump in EX, baits the DP. Gonna get this corner carry, spending with ES Tatsu, corners himself, gets the low run stop, out of throw range, and just like that, bad positioning of Joe Morovan on the offensive right now. Yeah, and maintaining this pressure too, going into the low, but oh, he gets clipped with the DP, that is unfortunate, back into the neutral. Both players too with V trigger on deck, there's activation nice time. Punish. Yeah, great punish. One more touch. Nope. Oh. Attack to stay alive. But for how long? Those are the double fireballs. EX does not connect, but he has to hold the throne. There you go. Finally, Joe Umi Rogan putting one on the board in terms of games, evening things out. And I see the I see the Umi Rogans in the in the chat try to get a little bit of that Maturino money when he wins, riding his coattails, saying if he wins, we all win, and we're all getting burgers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we can't afford Give that. The man that's <laughs> <laughs> not yet. It's a twenty-five dollar delivery yeah. charge in my part of town. Damn, it's really not that much, but it does feel like it. Like you order something and they're oh, like, yeah. "The meal is eighteen dollars, and to have a teenager bring it to you, it's twenty-three fifty. Like, hold on now, hold on now, <laughs> hold on. My teenagers were cheap. Yo, Tomtaku, we can get burgies if I see that Macharino prize will go up. Yo, exactly. Sir, he's he's right. Right. He's going <laughs> Hold this red right here. Umi Rogan with the damage on the deck. And hold him down with the red fireball. Cross Ooh. gun DP. Of course he's going to done do it. And there's the throw. There you go. Umi Rogan. Why'd you even switch? It was Akuma all along. It was the, This is the one you should have yeah, been with all along. Yeah, and what I think we're seeing a lot of is, is character. No, go ahead. Flex, sir. Oh, I was going to say, he's sitting on a set point right now. And he's definitely putting out the damage. I like the Akuma switch here, too. The air fireball kind of keeps him locked down. Yeah, I agree. And I think we're seeing a lot of, like, some character comfortability here, right? Because you even notice, like, Bumba stuff is getting away with a lot of these cross-up jumps and some other stuff against the Ryu. But as soon as that Akuma mm -hmm. switch came out, the cross-cut DPs came back, the, the neutral came back, like, Joe just looks more comfortable as an Akuma. Stay, yep, no side switch anymore. They nerfed that. Yup, crouch Ooh. fears, dash up. Was it the fireball? But again, these fireballs, better on Akuma's side. Neutral jump, fell for the season one. Woo! Yo, Bumba stuff trying to get it done. It's anybody's game right here. Breaks up oh, with the EX, dead. denies. No sympathy or empathy for that bad DP. Final game, final round. The sniff versus the snuff. Who's got it? Yo, this ain't Street Fighter 4. You trying to you trying to FADC that, my guy? Not today. Not today. I do kind of miss FADCs, though. Yo, triple dash! My dude was at Mario Kart Plus One, the Canadian version. Coming up, but this is the bust out. Ooh, love the catch on the Tatsu there. Great DP back in the corner for Bump Snuff right now. Joe Umaroga blocking him down. Calm in the corner right here. Trying to get the jump back. EX5. I will keep the plus frames. Activation. Goes low. Cross up though. That was dirty. Even Grandma can get cross up on these streets. I'm telling you. Doesn't matter who's on the court. Bump Snuff. Oh, you should uh -oh. confirm. Yo, is he going to bust out DP? Please do. Ooh. Please do. Ooh. 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 Only DP coming from Obi Rogan. Did you, did it's you only coming from Obi Rogan, baby. <laughs> Akuma wins. Not, my man, he said, Bumba, you need a VP. Umi Rogan said, hold up now. Let me take that from you. Let me take that one from you. Let me take that from you, dog. You put up the things on like me too. Umi Rogan. Where the Umi mm. Rogan's at in the chat? I see you lining up for your boy. You better you better give him the hype because he's going through in the bracket and done doing it. Damn, the cross-cut DPs, the switch was the thing. Keeping the corner pressure when he tried to leave, he made him pay the toll in terms of damage with the DPs on the deck. Umi Rogan, man, real solid. And it, I, think, I think it comes down to the comfort and the mental stack, right? Because when you play, I'm not saying that Joe Rogan's Ryu is bad, because it's not, but Joe has the yeah. muscle memory programmed with Akuma. So all the stuff that you would normally be thinking about during a match, a lot of that is just autopilot for Joe Rogan. So you start seeing the cross cuts, the meaty pressures, the better setup, because he's not thinking about, oh, this character can stand at this range versus this range. Like a lot of that stuff is just kind of coded right. into his movements. Whereas with the Ryu, he, you saw him standing there being a lot more thoughtful about like his placement and his spacing. Where with Akuma, he's kind of got that on lock. And it, you definitely saw that change up. Now we can so go into the chat. I believe we, 
What's up? <laughs> I was saying, t- speaking about Ryu, I believe up next week on deck we have Fluxoids versus Dells on Fire. So talking right, about some yeah. Ryu gameplay here. Yeah, it's going to be interesting. Obviously, Flux Waves, you know, time and time again, always placing at least in Grand Finals. I think he was robbed once uh, a couple weeks ago, but, you know, still managed to always make it into top eight. Extremely, and I want to emphasize, extremely strong, strong competitor, particularly with zoners. It's going to be a little bit difficult here for Delzon, it, it, you know, trying to find that gap in ability to kind of get damage on the board especially if he's zoned out but of course with Dells on fire it's draw very unpredictable ryu player which i think works in his favor against a lot of matchups so yeah it, it'll be interesting I, if he see. does play solid i feel like if he does play solid though um i feel like he can do some damage on poison i'm not sure the matchup in full how it goes this season but i think the fireball pressure plus with what he gets off the exchanges could actually be really beneficial for ryu and the fact that he gets so much continuous oki this season is kind of puts her on the back foot she doesn't have a traditional reversal it's having to spin v-bar may not be the most fun thing that she wants to do because she wants mm-hmm. to put you in the mix and also her whips the exchanges now don't do as much damage so like when you right. hit somebody you know and you you trade for these whips especially i mean if you're playing a kuma that's gonna suck but if you're playing a big boy like ryu who eats his weedies like come on now that's mm-hmm. gonna be a-okay for you to take a few hits here and there especially with these knockdowns off the ex fireball so if he plays solid if he wants to win i think he can put some uh put some work in on flux but We'll have to see because he built yeah. built unusual. Are you in the chat? You built unusual. Um, I'm, big... I'm sort of a Shoto player myself, you know. <laughs> like, okay, come on, dude. Come on now. Yes. My my first gamer tag was Shoto's on fire, but I decided to switch it so it was more accurate. But really, really though, I think you made the key right. The key <laughs> is can, if Dells can get in, he's gonna do a. Y'all, this is flux waves. Like, this isn't just any mm-hmm. poison, right? This is Flux with Zed. This is, this in is my opinion, wall. one of this is, this is the poison, right? Like, aside from the Idol, wall. this is the poison. Wall is Flux? Fight. Yep. Yo, here we go. The Love Me Tendies over the fireball early. Love Me Tendies. <laughs> okay. Oh, good to see every damn time. Come on, Tom. Sorry. You have the EU to thank for that. Crossing medium kick. Yo, Ooh, I like that to the get the Tarzan. Tarzan swing? Hits him with the Taskmaster. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ooh, but Just we gotta like wake that. up DP in here. Activation Sweet activation. Time. I get the chase down. He's got the health lead, but this could all go away. Even though the damage has been nerfed, it don't matter. And going for the new V trigger that we haven't seen before, because nobody's used it in a while, but still gets the job done. Fierce at the max range, at the very tip. Just the tip. That'll do it. Flux. Getting it in there. Okay, gonna let that EX rock. A little bit of stagger pressure with these medium punches. Already healed. The crush counter has stopped the Taskmaster swing. Dell's looking a bit different. Uh oh. Too early on that parry there. Jump in, nice. Using the down. Yeah, this is what we were stand. talking about. The Ryu's got the damage on deck, and even with that nerf, you know, it, it doesn't seem like it does a lot of damage, even with as many confirms as Flux is getting. But still walking, goes into the corner, but not for long. Out of here and into the neutral. Yeah, but thrown oh, out of the oh, stack. Wow. distance, and you forgot. Did you forget about the trigger? Did you forget that I had this thing on me? Yeah. Call an ambulance. Not for me, but for you, dog. Oh. Big jump and gets the win. Using the V skill to get the distance. Caught him lacking and slacking. Poison win. This is winter semi, so you know you don't want to don't want to go down like this. Dell, you better start putting your back into it. Round one. I'm now I'm saying like do it, do it, put your back into it. <laughs> That's what I was thinking too. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, I, I, I did it for you. Ooh, I love oh, the beat shot nice. there. Oh, but we got one of our own. Like, he's just not letting. He's, he's letting that sucker Tarzan. fly. No DP, yeah. no anti air. Tarzan. The Congo. Coming right. through. Yo, but speaking of the Congo, got the oh, big silver back fist. Dash up in the face. I'm going to take his face with the back throw. Yeah, walking out of there. 
Wow, just zoning with this whip. He wants to build up that meter for that one-touch situation. He's willing to do it to take down Dells. Yeah, especially he got critical art, he could go for the... Oh my... <gasps> He still has a life lead though, Flux Waves, that is. Yeah. Flux doesn't have to overextend. You jump over a fireball. But then again, you know, fire knows you can't get in that distance. Ooh, it's gotta be closer careful, though. to even. Oh! The X connects. Oh. Oh. They suck a oh, free. Oh man. Well placed <laughs> EX fireball there from Dells. Yo, the parry of the task match with the with switch? That. Yeah, finally jabbing the the, the, say the V skill there, but getting some good damage on the board. Flux is going in again with the V skill. Ridiculous. Oh. The man is abusing it. Oh, great what did you gotta do with the streets? Listen, if the guy's gonna bring his fist, I'm bringing a whip. If, if I was, you know, looking at this match, I'm bringing, definitely bringing a whip. Crush on the follow up. He woke up with something, put him back to sleep. Ooh. Try to go for the command grab, but the neutral Ooh. drop. This should be it right here. Fire getting it done. CA, I'm a C no! in that round. No! Oh, no. He missed the juggle. That is so unfortunate. Oh, he's got to be feeling heartbroken right now. As Flux takes the round and puts himself at match point. Flux knew Check it off. Jumped Get back in the game. Knowing he knew that Dells was going to use the back roundhouse as the anti-air, so he jumped in range and he could win punish it with the medium punch. Because Dells is a genius. Or excuse me, Flux is a genius. They're both geniuses. Well, mm, mm, Jerry's out one of them. But anyway, final part right here from Fire. <laughs> Take Goes in the back throw. I can throw Yo, over the range where you want to do this crouching fiercest. And just like this, oh, you almost get the stun. Interrupting, but the B ship. Take back your turn. It's yours. It's my turn, and I need to there's a stun. Uh, 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 uh. The man called JG Wentworth. <laughs> oh, two, 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 twenty, two, twenty, two. two, two Damage. Two. <laughs> <laughs> are you missing out on damage that you are owed? Have you been missing out on damage for months now and have still had no return phone calls? Call one eight hundred damage and we'll get it done. <laughs> <laughs> have you been that exposed? Because so <laughs> you so were good. Been been exposed, been exposed to Dills and Fire's DP. Because <laughs> you <laughs> made me liable <laughs> to compensation. <laughs> You're speaking of exposed. Look how late that DP repairs the red <laughs> cross. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Sorry. Crush again. Call press a button, dog. Oh. It's the meaty, no oh. vegan. Didn't want to believe in the fire or the DP after. I don't know if I'm connected or not, but so. If the nest in the bless with a throw. Oh, if you were a DP right there, that would have been sick, bro. Mm. Look at this. Even at this range, he walked up. Oh, oh, don't yes. do it. Yeah, you that is going to do it. Who oh. fast to say, don't do it. Like, my man's walking in. There's a murder in the building. Don't do it. But he can't hear us. He can't hear he us, guys. Us. Don't go in there. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Ooh, the what's, the, 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 oh, what's going on here? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> it's going to set Fox on set point. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> oh, no. The one with the back hook gives him the corner. Yeah, back into the neutral, though, as Dell's dash is out of there. The chase down, you get punished Bruh. for it. Dude, he's not playing Street Fighter anymore. He's Shit. playing Need for Speed. Tatsu. Double dash Tatsu. Mm -hmm. My guy's on a launch game on every game. PlayStation. Mm. All Woo. the way down, dog. Dells. I like that. Final I game, final that. round. Dells versus Flux going. And if Dells can put a few more wrinkles in that brain, I feel like he might be able to take this. Seriously, put the iron away. Play the set. Yo, lands on top of the fireball. A little bit of stagger pressure. Dells backs off out of whip range. Neutral jumping, looking for a chance to come in again. But again, Flux is happy to zone and look for their opportunity. He's over. Oh, yeah, but jumping. we get a great jump in there from Dells on chasing. Flux like <gasps> down. Okay, no! The one time he just connected to the roundhouse. He does have CA though. Dells is a conversion. Dead. That could have been it. Didn't believe it. I believe it. That's it. And that'll do it. Dell's taking it. When he, when he, 
finally puts his brain down on, on the controller, he starts making magic happen. And I, don't make me compliment him, please. But that was kind of fresh. <laughs> that was kind of fresh. That was kind of nice. He gonna click and nice. use it later, but that was kind of fresh. Mm -hmm. Yo, that's gonna go as a sponsor me real, right? Like, my name is Dells on Fire, and I am a good <laughs> Shoto. I like Shotos because, and then the clip starts playing. That's the stuff we need to see from Dells. JG Wentworth is out of business because Dells is doing damage. Oh, yeah. mm. was, also, my camera was, changed. I, I, there's been a lot of good oh, yeah, reads that uh, Dell had made, also the Crouching Fierce and stuff like that. Also, again, the mm -hmm. fireball trades and stuff, like you saw how hesitant Flux was to kind of throw out the whips. Usually in the previous seasons, you could throw that out, get the trades and stuff like that. But this season, right, he's going to knock you down. All, all of a sudden, three dashes later, he can smell what you ate for breakfast. So. Keeping yep. on the pressure was Dell. So when he got things done, he got the he got he got it one. It was a, it was it was a wrap. And Chicken I, cheese in it. It's a wrap. I want to say that when Dell's did the triple dash Tatsu, it didn't work. But when Dell's played fundamentals, <laughs> it worked great. I'm just saying for all you out there watching, thinking how should I adapt sure. my play style based on this match? When Dell's played solid, Dell's won. That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. Uh huh. That's wild. I was gonna say though the thing I, that I is wild. interesting and it kind of. It kind of proves to, again, these changes, even though they don't seem that drastic, really do appear drastic when you're seeing them in the matchup. Obviously, um, you know, Sankola mentioned the fact that we can't throw out the, the whip as liberally as you could. That played a huge role in allowing Dozen Fire to close in that distance pretty quickly. And the big thing, too, Poison doesn't do as much damage anymore. So you have to get so many confirms. I mean, you really have to work for it. But speaking for working for it, we got Dells on Fire versus Joe Umarogan up next. Going into winner's finals for a chance under the grand final spot. Definitely want to be on the winner side of things, uh, you know, with this bracket and again with the point system that's been going on. We'll talk about that later, but you definitely want to have that nice top spot. And right now, great round start for Fire. Put him in the corner, but here's a rebuttal. Joe Umi Rogan. Oh, the shimmy. Caught him reaching, and now Umi Rogan's on the offensive. Dell saying, "Listen, I still will throw out the EXDP. Back to neutral. Gonna sand and parry. Dell's a little bit of a life lead. Happy to make Joe come to him. Walks under. Good catch." Activate. Fireball for Fierce. Connects. Woo! There you go. Right to the face. Put him in his place. Only Rogan. Getting dusted for that. Wow. Dash up He fell a certain kind of way before. He said, said, oh, he said, he said I'll, I'll show you the CFN. <laughs> <laughs> We're still online, baby. Yeah, break on the throw here. I like this from Joe and Marova. What, being a little more patient, just walking forward, oh, now oh, just standing. Oh, I think I think there's a problem. Oh, you know, okay. Yeah. Well, was, uh, well really, trying to make a draw, brother. Come on now. Yeah, there we go. I think Are Joe's we taking that? Are we taking back that? into it. Oh, Both oh players look, are maybe standing. there's a connection yeah. issue. Yeah. I looking think, for I a... Might be. Yeah. Let's see if I need to play catch up real quick. Listen, if I'm if I'm fire, I'm sorry, dog. <laughs> you know what you got yeah. into. <laughs> you know what you played in. Yeah, it's tough. Bro. <laughs> I want that money. <laughs> yep. I mean, it's true, right? And like, it's interesting because you saw like Uma Rogan getting a little bit of a life lead, and then Dell's immediately taking it back. Like, nah. Oh, there it is. Nah, That's conversion. Dog, nah. Dell's gonna take the game. For you. Wait, it's frustrating, but at the same the time. I want that Macharino money. Oh, you I want that Macharino money. I want that Uber Eats money. You gotta hold that. You gotta hold that. <laughs> bro, he's probably gonna go order food right after this match because his turn was done, bro. Guaranteed. It's go time. Yeah, I, they're they're typing in the Discord right now. We're gonna see what they're saying. All right, cool. Get some All TO right. calls. Figure so out what's going on. While we're patiently wait, I was gonna say while we're patiently waiting, make sure you guys go. Please, please, please check out the Macharino. 
you know, give these guys something even more to fight for. You can follow the steps. It's easy as one, two, three, four. You go and sign up for Match Arena. You click the link and contribute. Uh, obviously, you have a couple different ways you can tr contribute. You can use the coupon code DH4ASFV. Adds a free 50 cents to the prize pool. Costs you nothing but a couple of keystrokes. And then, of course, too, if you got a little change in your pocket, you can send it their way as well. It does support the bracket. It supports the, the stream and everyone in between. And last but not least, if you want to get that extra cushion, you already used your code. You don't got any, any money to throw in there because we haven't had the stimulus check in yet. You can complete sponsorship quests on the right hand side. And I'll give you a little hint here. Some of them will ask you to like follow certain people or retweet stuff. You know, you, you can follow them and then unfollow people later. So just, just a little uh, heads up for you if you want to support Matcherino. And the best part too about this is that you don't even have to make a Matcherino account. If you're watching this live on Twitch right now, there's a Twitch button that you can click on when you're on Matcherino and you can log in right through Twitch. So definitely be sure to take advantage of that. Yep. Back to the match now. All right, let's go. Yeah, we're back in it. Uh, Dells is up 1-0 over Joe and the Rogan. And we're back to Nooch. Back to the gameplay. Tries to toss it through a fireball he thought was coming. It's a low forward buffer does Joe. And now he's got corner control against Dells. So Ooh. Yeah, this looks like there's a few drop confirms as I say that. Ah, uh, but see, as I say that, Umi Roll get dropped, but a few confirms that he usually doesn't drop all these medium kicks. You know, not finishing his plate in his combos. Dell's on fire, taking everything back, you know, back just like that. He's like, listen, if this is the condition we were playing, I'm dashing in. Yep. Yeah, Dell's on fire right now, sitting on V trigger. I know he's itching to activate it. But. Woo! Yo, he Talk about it. Nice time to get all right, activation time though for Joe Umar Rogan, but he's gonna get back thrown. Can't dash in there. There's a fireball waiting for you. Oh, wow. Wow. yo, you put the things on like me too. Nice DP, oh. but knows how <laughs> unfortunate. He thought he was gonna press, but he got blessed. Back throw, there you go. Yeah, Umar right. Rogan. Yo, we got taken to church. All right, we got a little mm. forwards going off the sword plexus minus two. Shimmy gets a whiff, punishes Dells, but out of range for the conversion. Bad DP, that had to have been a fireball, but not wrong. Dell's yeah, jumping out of the ex, a... uh, air fireball range. Yeah, but you hate to see it, right? The input buffer gets you sometimes. Football yeah, has a turf monster, Street Fighter has that. <laughs> <laughs> and Joe Umarogan has V trigger, but so does Dell's on fire going with the activation, but I guess both players want it. Oh, the parry on the demon head. flip, denying the demon flip, denying the demon you flip. I, he popped that sucker and said, I wish you would, because if you do it, I got something for you. Fire with another one. Got that yeah, DJ Khaled on deck. Doesn't fire up <laughs> two right now in the match, looking to take it into grand finals. Got one more. Yeah, I and I, and I, again, I, I feel like it's it's not the character. It's just missing these conversions. You know, not completing the combos because Akuma is an Oki machine. Like that's where he lives. Get that mm -hmm. continuous pressure. And I feel like he can fight right. You this thing. players are pretty unhappy about the nerfs, but he definitely has a lot of tools to work with. But if the tools, if you if you if you put a screwdriver in a hole and it's already open, like what are you doing? You you're you're in the wrong right. spot. So if you try to construct, listen, Akia is hard. I get it. It is. Give the instructions, it is. though. Y'all look at your notes. And he looked at his notes. He said, "Let me. I don't want a desk anymore. Let me get a stand-up desk. I don't want to sit down anymore. I want a stand-up mm -hmm. desk. We do something different." Yo, standing's, for the standing's good for the health. It's good for the health. You're right. Actually, you're right. But look, this is so we're seeing the same kind of strategy from Joe Morogan we saw last time on the Rio pick, right? Just kind of standing still, trying to bait something out. Dell's happy to play the fireball game. Rocks a neutral. Tries to low profile. Gets hit with a solar plexus strike. And Dell's is a big life lead and is happy to keep playing the nooch. Wow. Sweep for a sweep. Ooh. The whip punish. Yeah, but you run right into the fireball. It's going to sting. But activation time here for Doom Rogan. But he gets back thrown into oblivion. Putting Dell's and fire on match point. Yo, I like that whiff punish to low forward underneath the roundhouse. Dashing up, getting clipped. Okay, gonna take his turn after the solar plexus. Look at Delson Fire. He knows his character. 
He knows Ryu. He's been with this character for so long. He knows the strings. He knows what to parry. He's like, dog, you better not pick my character again. You should have came with the. Look at him. He's styling right now. You said you better mm -hmm. next time pick your main. Don't come out here picking my character like you know what's going on. This should be a punish. Yes, that's minus. Yeah. Okay, but Umarogan does have the corner locked up now. Dell's is going to toss him away. Put on the Ooh. helicopter. Yo, dash it, bro. Oh, oh, oh the the anti air to close it. Oh, oh with the crush counter, Ferda. You win. Guys, Damn, that's how you know battle. that you. Again, that sounds on win, something. Winner's side. Winner's side. Listen, listen, listen. And this time he's not I playing saw, around. Okay. This was lucky. Okay, so and he, beat he, he was in the. Did, I got, I got a so question. He the, did he ask what Bumba Snuff was sniffing? Because Dells and Fire seem to be on that same stuff moving through this bracket mm -hmm. into grand finals. Uh, I, I don't know if he can handle the Scotch bonnet peppers, though. We'll have to see. We'll have to see in a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> My dude's mainlining Ryu buffs. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he's just like cutting up the buff like this and just put him directly in the nose. I don't even need to read him. I just snip him up and I'm good to go. <laughs> he knew what to do with the buffs. He knew what to do with the extensions, the V trigger stuff. He was definitely on something different, built different out here. Delzon, when he's got, when he finally wants to play, he can play, right? When he stops messing around, I see you in the chat being stupid. But when you want to play, you, you you can play. And that's why you're winner side. Finish the job and get it done. All right, you got to finish the job. You you go back to your boss, like it's done, it's done, boss. You look back, you're like, did you see the body? You see him? With, where's the body at? You didn't bring back no head. Uh, I thought I thought I finished off the job. But I'm sorry, boss. You got to get the job done. And you got someone coming up the loser side. We're gonna go there in a second to see who's gonna be facing off against him. See if we can get that win or not. Yep. Mm -hmm. Saint No, 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 no. Right Hold now. on now. He's not Saint Fire. Oh, Come on now, yeah. chat. Hold on now. Hold on now. He doesn't deserve that. Silver Rupee, calm, calm down. Calm down. Calm down, Silver Rupee. <laughs> Shadow Ace, yeah. Delson Fire stole my lunch money. <laughs> <laughs> lunch money. <laughs> That's a very Dell's. It's a very Dell's move. Dell's on cola. Would not drink it. Would not drink it. Mm, no, nah, that's a little bitter. It tastes like something bitter. <laughs> like some, some <laughs> orange pico. <laughs> Ta hey, tastes like whatever playing Ryu for five years tastes like. So like, <laughs> oh. like stale bread, dirt, and like stale bread, hot dog water, probably around and, that and stuff. I don't know. Uh, I'm convinced Ryu doesn't shower. I'm convinced the man doesn't shower. So I, all probably. I know no is way. I want to be 10 feet away from him. For sure. Soccer's got bad taste in me. man's because he don't shower. I know. So, listen, that's that's her kink, and I'm not going to shame it. I don't enjoy it. She likes feet. She likes to stink. I don't enjoy it, but she's into it. That's cool. That's on you, Sakura. Yep. That's cool. And if you out there, you like that, like, you know, that was on fire, like, and Ryu like that, that's cool too, dog. I don't know. But, you know, that's whatever gets you the top spot of Grand Finals, Digital Havoc, whatever you got to do, dog. Mainline and buffs or, yep. you know, smelling Ryu, whatever you got to do, dog. It's getting the job done. But I'm curious to see who's going to face it off against some We're going to lose their side and some, yeah. some body bags and send them on their way. You got Flux Waves versus Lizard Man next on stream. Uh, Lizard Man just Ooh. actually beat Orphan Crippler 2-1. Uh, Wow, that's Whoa. that's wild. He he also he also beat Z's nuts as well too, or um just before that as well two one. He beat Z's I mean, nuts. Yes, I, I expect Lizardman to beat Z's nuts. <laughs> yes, that's how he is. relaxes before a tournament, right? Vigorously, very very much <laughs> vigorously. <laughs> vigorously beating these nuts. I mean, it must have been a vigorous match. <laughs> um, yeah, for sure. I, I mean, clearly that. he beat it like. He beat it like it owed him money, right? Like, he was like, listen here. <laughs> <laughs> now pay me five bucks. <laughs> Where's my money? <laughs> Where's my five? Okay, I'm going to right stop. I'm going to stop. I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> anyway, these nuts got beat. Got got by, by, got beat. by Lizard Man. <laughs> <laughs> there, there ain't no way to to put that nicely. <laughs> They're gonna clip this and be like, "Don't ever put these people on the mic again." But listen, yeah. you guys are enjoying this creature butterfly action. We didn't want to give you the esports stuff. We give that raw style, that wild style. So if you're enjoying all the action, the commentary too as well. Run the match, you know, excellent work. Match, you know, run the chat just like that. Run the code because we got flux waves versus lizard man on the deck. Let's do it. Let's get this going. This losers quarters. We're back oh, to two out of three. Winner is going to battle Bumbasnuff. 
and Flux Switch bringing out the Monad. Okay, you gotta be careful though. The Rashid music's playing. The power ups on deck, right? Rashid's always doing better when you hear his music. Yeah, right now, Flux, I, I have to appreciate Flux got the crush and, you know, just kind of keeping Lizardman at bay. Obviously, Minot had some love this season too, so going in, got clipped by the uh, the tornado there. It was a little unfortunate. Well, there's not, like, there's not many ways that she could stop, but and being able to like, stitches off the V skill, uh, her V trigger being stronger, but the dive takes from Lizard Man from the skies. No surprise he's gonna be doing that. And this is rare for him. V skill one, V skill one Lizard Man definitely wants that money today. Yeah, oh. going for the winning matchup, right? No clowning, no clown shoes. But Flux Waves, big lively, just walking back, looking for that tap. Wow, Flux. Lizardman felt something. Woo! Feeling that drill click to the knees. Out of there with the first round. Flux has done a great job of just checking him a lot, you know, getting a little bit of pressure and just going back to neutral. Dive kicks like this, making Lizardman feel real uncomfortable. And some of these dive kicks from Lizardman, on the other hand, have landed. Some of the, you know, other things have landed too, but just not in a lot of succession to build the damage that he needs to get things done. And the crush interrupting that B skill. Yo, rolling underneath the orb. I like that idea from Lizardman getting in. Yo, activation catches the landing frames. V shift out, baits and bites. Dive kicks, corners. Yo, Lizardman looking good. Yeah. Good defense, though. Pretty deep, yeah. Oh, I was about to say, yeah. Flexor's with the defense. It's okay, out of there, but he's getting flipped. Woo! Critical art time. Did she have that before? I. I don't know if that was like a patch change right there. As you could be, be, no, uh, she's, she's uh, always, skill into the she's, super. She's, she's, always, had yeah. she's always had that. Yeah, yeah, I've just never seen her she, do that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, but now I'm seeing Flux kind of do I, it right here. That's the thing is like you usually not. see like like a the either conversion into the V trigger and then into the super and never see it roll off the V skill. But Flux just makes sure the job was done, just doing it right off the V skill super. Then one hit to do it. Damn. Okay, I see you, Flux. I see you. That stand like it just new like stand like it V skill C A. Going for it. Round one. Ready for it. Fight. And I hope you guys are ready because we are getting right back into a one up on the board here for Flux Waves. Ooh, and a great neutral jump, I gotta admit. The orb sweep. Ooh! B shift. This is what I'm talking about, where it's not studied enough, but the ideas yep. are there to use that in the in the neutral. Yeah, I cannot wait for like a year from now when we start seeing optimal V shift use utilization, right? Where it's been labbed and micro set up. Mm. Ooh, yeah. Unfortunately, there got clipped with the V shift, but going in with the throw, Lizardman keeping this pressure on. What the character's all about that Ooh. good corner pressure, big jump in. That'll get the win. The stun and done. You know, something a bar like the build a bear in the throw. I feel like Lizardman has to be more confident with this character in terms of fighting, you know, fighting Monat. Cause like, once you get in, you put her in the corner, she doesn't have many ways to get you off her. Right. Yo, reversal Ooh, CA wow. gonna connect? No! Wow. I, Yo, I guess this man had the reach. He would done do it. Ooh, but he gets lit there. Nice air to air, but... Whoa! That roundhouse reached? My god! I I wonder if that's like a nerf to the V skill, just hanging in the skies a little bit longer. I'd have to look at the patch notes. Crush of his own. Lizard Man getting the Oki situation. Neutral jump to blow up the V ship! And that actually might do Whoa. it! No, 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 that was time perfect. That was me. Oh, that was me. There's no vegan on that, sir. I would like the uh, the vegan options. You came to the came to the wrong place. It's a steakhouse. The Ponderosa. It's a Ponderosa, baby. We only got steaks oh, here. They know what the Ponderosa. To Ponderosa I, I, this, might, this, this might be too old for some people. Ponderosa oh, was that thing back in the day. <laughs> no, we had those. But yo, we listen, I came to play. Yeah. Even it out. Oh really? Oh yeah, because you're my age, aren't you? Yeah, yeah. I yeah yeah. We're we're close ish. <laughs> Jump around house. We're close, we're close. <laughs> yeah. We still have Sizzler, I think. I don't think all the Sizzlers are gone yet. 
Yo, dash no, up. No, no, no. There's, there's still Sizzlers out there. And speaking of Sizzling right yeah. now, Flock's putting the damage out here, but Lizardman. Oh, look at that roundhouse to Elise. You're right. That's got to be a nerf where it floats in the air a little longer. I gotta pull these change notes up. Yeah, definitely have not seen too many of the things from Anant because, you know, this is not a character that was up on the higher on the, on the list of, of players or characters that players will play, but it's working out for Flux in terms of keeping the distance. A lot of these checks to crush connects. And that was a crush count that's going to build closer, closer to that feature kind of situation for Flux even sooner. And the interruption here. You're dashing in. You got to mind the speed limit. You're going 60 to 25. I'll write you a ticket. And the payment, the payment is your help. Mm. <laughs> this song has the best breakdown too. You just want to bob that head when it hits. Feel. You gotta feel it. You gotta feel the song. Gotta yeah. feel wow. Again, you gotta have the confidence to kind of rush them down. Because that's the name of the game of this character. Holding back is not what Wizard Man's doing. Finally getting the anti air. Yeah, but again, activation time. Gonna put the orbs on deck, and it is infinite combos. Yep, in the super CA, I'll see you out of the tournament, my friend. It was a, it was a good one. Mm -hmm. But Flux Waves taking it just like that with the CA over Lizard Man, optimal stop, and actually stay solid. Even when the They're orbs weren't landed, wave. the Miss Cleos weren't coming through. One of the phone calls came through at the end. It was a heavy one. It's like you have a brother. His name is James, right? And Lizard Man's like, yeah, James, I do. James, I do. James? How did you know? How did you know? <laughs> Is he okay? I think he might be in danger. <gasps> That'll be six sixty nine ninety nine. I don't know why it's that price. I don't know why it's what? that nice. But what yeah, was yep. also nice was Flux <laughs> nice. with that absolute <laughs> perfect neutral. I have to do it. It that happened during CPT. I the the number came up and he and someone won. It was like Smug versus uh whatever, and it got to sixty nine. I was like nice, and I said that I was like oh god. <laughs> I actually, I actually, I actually guffawed out loud, and my wife was like, "What's so funny?" I'm like, "He said nice at 69," and she's like, "What?" <laughs> yeah, we were, we were loving it, dude. <laughs> I'm loving these matches too, by the way. Yeah, <laughs> so all over, over oh, man. man. We're gonna have play, uh, play. one more snuff up next versus uh, Flux Waves. Actually, it's gonna be our loser Ooh. semis match. Winner, this will be playing up loser against Joe and Rogan. So we're in top four. I'm curious. Like, I am either too. way, I think either way, let's see, Bum Snuff lost to Joe. Okay, no, no. So the only player that could potentially get into grand finals that has not been dropped down by Dells would be Bumba. Or, yeah, would be Bumba Snuff, right? Mm. Dells beat Flux 2 1. Dells beat Joe and Morogan yeah. 2 1. Mm -hmm. So it's either two salty runbacks or a Snuff of Bumba. Like, you got to pick one. <laughs> I oh, was that the have song? The stuff. It seems like the stuff is a good stuff. The snuff is a good stuff. A bomba. Dun, 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 dun. Na, 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 snuff a bomba. The EXDP. And an airborne Itatsu. Dun, 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 dun. Then an airborne Itatsu to cross you up. To cross you up. To cross you oh up. I can just see people in the <laughs> background. They're, they're blasting this and they're just sniffing up Ryu patch notes all like just in the background, yes. having a party, yes. putting in the margaritas because that's what's been going on. This right, this Ryu running rampant out here. If it's not in the CFN, it's what the people have been playing this character for a long time. Really, you know, I, I we joke about Delzon out here, but he definitely is a super soft player when he wants to be. Yeah, and these absolutely. patch notes, these these, yes. these buffs have only helped him become a like more solid because at some level your character needs more stability and Ryu didn't have that. He didn't right. have the mix. He didn't have the ways to really get this damage going. And he really doesn't have the mix still, but if he hits you, it hurts. And he has way more ways to hit you. And he has more ways to ensure that too. So that's why yep. uh does on fire staying even more solid than usual. Yep. And on patch note day, I don't know if y'all were, I mean, you know, Dells and I talked to each other on Twitter and I follow him and all that, you know, fun stuff, you know, because I, mean, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to toot my own horn, but, you know, we're kind of friends. Dells and I are kind of friends, I think. Kind I think of Dells friends? and I are friends. Yes, Just like we're he's kind of, of a Shoto player. Oh. Like he's kind of a Shoto player, we're kind of friends. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. 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 But like, he was going nuts over these Ryu buffs, right? And so was Nogaremi. Oh, yeah. and, like, a lot of the Ryu community, like, uh, we've seen AM Kid back on the grind, right? There's so many Ryu yeah. players yeah. that are finally getting their, like, their day in the sun, right? 
And so I'm stoked to see it. I'm stoked to see it. It's looking like Chun Li season four out here. Mm-hmm. Mm, yeah, yeah, it kind of is. Or 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 Cami season three. Man, oh, those were the, we don't talk. About those that. We were don't talk the about days. Last <laughs> <laughs> yeah, season, Seth. That. But you know what? To be honest, I'd rather have Ryu be stronger than all the other characters. We're not gonna be seeing Ryu here. We're we'll seeing his his rival, his friend, Ken. Bumble snuff, sniffing mm. that good stuff. Is it good enough to take down Flux? Let's see. <clears throat> Okay. Oh. Yo, the trade's still working oh, out for uh, right. Poison and this, though. Yeah, and getting nice crush. Nothing off of it, though. And miss on the ant here. But still, you know, making things move. Looks like Bumble Snuff, too. Yeah. yeah. Bumble Snuff, too. Very cautious about, like, trying to make this forward momentum coming in. Cautious, my man's jumping. He's Finally. from the Congo out Woo! here. Bubba stuff sniffing. He said, I'm throwing caution to the wind with the big jump in. That jumping okay. fierce, busting the dome, getting the throw pressure right here. Nice to throw bait, the OS. Talk to on the other side, cross up again. Anyone Damn. can get crossed up in these streets. Even your grandma can get crossed up in these streets with the Bubba stuff's <laughs> on the sticks. Cool, can I ask you a question? Yeah, what's up? What you, what you got against grandmas? <laughs> I just. I just, uh, you know, my my grandma, my grandmas are great. Other people's maybe not so much. Let's just have it. Let's have Ma. it that way. Ah, uh, all right, okay, all right. Pull right, right. well, out to get your grandma. Just like yeah, Flux is out to get bonus stuff right now, clipping these pillows and getting the stun. Listen, oh, tell any grandmas right now to see me in Street Fighter right now. See me right now. Just like, just like, get the stun in the corner. Okay, Jump, the message. Catch his grandma, catch these hands. Go <laughs> <laughs> catch his hands, grandma. Stop shaking, come catch his hands. Yo, what's up, y'all? Stop, 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 stop shaking. Yeah, I don't know what he did, but you gotta stop shaking too. Oh, you gotta stop looking like grandma out here and get those hands steady. <laughs> and ready. Oh, man, oh, that here. button's still good. Gets the counter hit whips. Oh, oh he's too right? far though. Ooh, get a nice cross up here. Tatsu DP Ender got the whole meal and then some. Yo, I see you, Bumba Snuff. Cross up, empty jump, Delowski. Yo, V shift. The X connects. One more hit to do it. Ooh. Again, the crouching pierce, these OS situations right here, where you kind of just throw up the throw or, or just a little jab to make them flinch and then hit them for yep. it. Yep. Ken wins. Yeah, smart corner attack from Bumba Snuff. Taking the game. Up 1-0 over Fluxways. I also like the fact that, like, he doesn't put himself in a situation where he gets back thrown and allows the character to kind of do what she wants to do in terms of, like, locking down snuff because he's been real mm -hmm. mobile and real movement-based with the movement and the movement. He knows that they have that right distance, so it doesn't, you know, it prevents him from getting thrown in the corner and then Fluxwave starts his offense. So now we're going to be starting to see something different from Flux. I know it ain't gonna be no 11. Don't even play like that, Flux. Nah. You, ain't, you ain't got no 11 like that. You ain't gonna do that nah. with the money on the line like that. You ain't made about ain't, that life, Flux. He ain't doing that. He ain't doing it. Nah. But it could be. I think I'm gonna see him. Mika, yeah. That's, that was with my brain, too. Yo, yep. you were monster right. Hunter to boot. Love to see it. I'm about to get gripped Mika's up. Mika's just a dope happen. character. She is. Yeah, it doesn't matter what character you're fighting exactly. We positive just say you about to get gripped up, dog. I get close <laughs> and put the hands on you. They don't. I'm gonna make you run them tables if I put you in the corner. So Bubba's up gonna have to hold on the neutral. That's kind of hard for this character. And now things begin. Now the tables are run. The casino's open. Yeah, he's gotta adapt to a totally different game plan because you're going against first a zoner, but now you've got someone who's going to be in your face and Ooh. already. Putting a lot of damage on the board. Flux is following it up again. The bump from the butt. Bubba stuff gonna have to hold Ooh. it. Wow, just mashing buttons, getting the confirms. Bump is now trying to jump out, didn't want to get gripped up, and instead got slapped up. And that's a round. Flux. This neutral doesn't look that fun for Ken. Like that mid distance, like where she can drop kick or just interrupt a lot of this stuff. But never mind. See, all good confirms. But the wake ups. 
all the back and forth. Y'all, can you let me explain one thing before y'all, yo, know, go chaotic? You know, there's, 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 there's right now, right? Yo, Damn. this is Mika can talk faster. Hands. <laughs> I gotta get, I gotta, gotta be I gotta double time that. Yeah, you oh, gotta be talking like you're reading the, uh... Oh, nice. Like you're reading the, uh... something? Yep, like you're selling something, you're doing like the, the fine print at the end of a... Hey, wait, 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 wait. I bet you, wait, wait, wait. Okay, well, what is it called? I don't know what it's called. The, like, the, the terms and conditions from like a drug commercial. I can't think of... Yo, the low oh. four confirms though, going with the empty low. Double tap, oh, dash up, okay. toss. Oh, like the side effects? Yeah, that's, that's mm. it. That's the thing. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's yeah, okay. and that, that, okay. Speaking of side effects, oh, the does you come and in Flux Wings with the critical art? Yo, the side effects nice. of that That's B trigger two being the best friend's boots to the dome. Flux waves tying it up. You have to read the label for the side effects of that clap mm -hmm. right there that you will be having double -cheeked when you up, wake man. up in the morning. Double cheeked up on a Thursday. Flux waves coming through. Double cheeked up on a Thursday, dog. Why are you doing it to me like that? Double I cheeked up to. on a Thursday. Flux out here. Listen, he turned around. Gonna... I was like, man, on a Thursday. <laughs> I thought that was only on Wednesday nights, but my man's getting it on Thursday too. Mm -hmm. Hey man, Jamaicans, they, 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 they don't play when it comes to that, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so we're one of these. Let's see what happens here. Got to do something different. I feel like the neutral is the hardest thing to lock down against Mika. He's getting rushed out. In some of these wake up situations, we've seen, like, Fox will just challenge. He's going to start swinging. And I feel like it was a little bit more of the Oki side. A little bit more on the uh, the weight and bait kind of thing, and a little bit more pensiveness mm -hmm. on these wake up situations. It might be better for him, but then again, Flux is so hard to put, to pin down. I felt like there was just a lot yeah, of times. Yeah, like... Yeah, I was going to say too. I noticed like there were times where he could have just busted up with ESDP and like he just held that pressure or tried to V reversal jabs yeah. and like you can't really do that. Right. With Mika. Yeah, you've got to put the fear into Mika to let her know you're willing to do that so that she's not always just getting the meaties. But as I say it, dash up, command grab, perfect frame kill, tick throws. Oh, wow, just went for the meaty peach. Oh, interruption there. Kick. I like this. Checking him. Yeah. Finds off the, 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 the Ooh, little nice. bunch of the EX, but yo, this is what you were talking about. Bust out. But the I wake up again. Disrespectful. Oh, gotta respect the meter. That toxin was kind of scary. <laughs> the toxin from full screen, full screen, the classic the act activation time. Walk it out. It was this all. All those buttons yeah, were so scary. Because he definitely wants to interrupt like some of these fireballs at that close range, right? Like if you throw out something, yep. I will yeah. hurt you for it. Yeah, there oh, it is, just, just like, like you that. said. You try to, yep, that button's so that quick, you can't right. press, you've got to get out of range. Wow, that's that slide. For flux. Right in the DMs. Not left on red here. Ooh. Oh my Ooh. goodness, get back. Is that going to be damage? Okay, yeah, and it gives him yeah. still a corner advantage. He still doesn't have V. Oh, there we go. He's got V trigger now. Oh! Yeah, but activation time, damage on the board. But He's Flux gonna go with got, the this time uh, of the V shift. Yeah. He, he has to watch out for another V shift, possibly, though. Not enough, though. Throw, not enough, though. Dude, he careful the fireball pressure right here. Just a tippy touch. Oh. A two on one. <laughs> a double team. Oh. A double stuff. Guys, a counter hit. One more will do it for either person. Get some oh my god, the oh, devil is down there, and the blood's taking it! Sucks. The two hits that were just enough for him to get EX too, man. Damn. Optimal. Optimal. He calculated this. He was in the lab. He was scientific. When he was pouring shit in the bleakers, back and forth, the green and the blue. Oh, I can make this color. I can make them. Oh, we'll sip this. And now I feel strange. But I don't feel strange about that match. Seeing Flux work like that. Damn. Flux. I don't know what you were drinking in the, in the lab, but it made you feel unusual. And bubble stuff, which is not up to snuff. Ooh-wee. That was a good match. Ooh. It was a good match.
Yeah, I like the switch over to Mika too. I think that really worked out in his favor. He and again too, I think Bumba Snuff was having a harder time trying to, uh, you know, adjust his own gameplay because used to seeing flux waves playing out that real neutral heavy real zoner heavy gameplay and then when you suddenly see the mika switch and you're like oh shit what do i do to keep mika out of here we didn't see right. a lot of those tools that like ken has to kind of combat that and play his own little bit of zoning game so really unfortunate there flux waves mm -hmm. though gonna be moving on to face against joe uma rogan in losers finals for a chance the face off and a salty run back against uh mr dell's on fire Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah Definitely. Up the also, side of things those, use up those channel points too we just set up a prediction as well let us know who you think is going to make it into the grand finals Joel and Morogan, yeah. Yeah, hell yeah yo I run run up in the chat I need I need to see y'all use up them points you ain't using them for anything else you don't get to take them home you don't get a you don't get a toy like you would at Chuck E. Cheese you need to use them right here right now to see who's gonna be moving on in this bracket Oi, Joe. Joe Umi Rogan, Danielle, all y'all up in the chat. I see y'all. Silver Ruby coming through. Fire, you need to be focused on your match. Hopefully got the notes ready because I feel like if Flux gets to you, you, it, you might get yep. choked up. But let's see what happens here because he's got to go up against Umi Rogan. Yo, Bar, let's go. Mm. Okay. Well. Seeing you out here. Again, starting off with the, that fireball gameplay. Kuma, pretty good at it. But Flux going in with the whip. You gotta be careful too. You wanna be cautious of that spacing. You don't wanna get clipped. Ooh. Nice. Very good use of the break to get some there. distance. Yeah. Plus, you get the gray life too. That helps out quite a bit. And any hit that comes next. Hmm. Woo! I, Flux has fell for that a couple of times. We've seen that, right? Where where Flux yeah. will will someone whip a throw and those OS that into like a DP or a, a, any kind, sort of button, right? So Flux definitely gotta watch out for that. Again, easier said than done. Ooh, the V shift. Still stuck in the corner oh, though. Finally gets something out. I would like to see a break there just to get outside of the corner and get that push. Oh, finally. This yeah. helps. Activation time. Nice get versus the crouching mini kick. Demon Palm. Throw tech. Nice oh. interruption on the B skill. He knows the gaps. It's just like that. So caught in the corner. Finds him to kick red fireball. Nice. B skill to do it. Wiping his hands off like he had some bad barbecue. Look at you. Joe Umi Rogan with the first one on the board. Losers finals. And you yeah, know Joe like a man like Akuma's really been in those caves. <clears throat> no way he's ever had good barbecue <laughs> living in all those caves, right? Like he's out there looking for the dark head dough, trying to cook meat over some trees. Never had the good stuff. Imagine not having sauce with your barbecue. Like not being able oh to season goodness. it. Just it it's he oh. might as well just eat rocks, dog. He might as well just eat rocks. Yep. Yep. Nah, now That's I want the first one at Umi Rogan. What do you think is what do you think the adjustments have to be from Flux here? I think uh, I think it's a little bit difficult. I mean, obviously he could try to go with a V skill switch. Uh, you know, we saw that pan out pretty well in prior matches against another Shoto, as far as because of the invincibility with the fireball. Um, but again, too, he's got to be cautious of that air fireball. So I don't know if maybe a character switch is going to be better in this case. Yeah, it's looking like he's going with the Mika. This is still difficult though. Like her neutral is not good against this yeah. character. The fireball right. gameplay isn't good. Crouching Fierce and Standing Fierce are really great. And if you find those Crouching Wicked conversions when they happen, nice. they're really great. But this is the other hand of things. No matter who you are, if I put you in the corner. Mm-hmm. I do yeah, yeah and like, thing... you already saw that low forward buffer. Oh go ahead, Flex. Oh, I was gonna say the thing we have to be mindful of too. Obviously Akuma doesn't have a ton of health, and Mika can hit hit pretty hard and put the damage out there, so it doesn't take a lot of confirms to get the ball rolling. Seeing that here. Teleport though. Okay, but he teleports out. Fireball. Okay, what's the setup here? It's gotta be something important. Oh, rock oh, 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 oh. He waited. Can, can I just say it's really funny when Akuma was like teleporting out of there? He was just like, hmm. And it just like tickled me in such a way. <laughs> he was like, hmm. 
Mm, mm, let me just think about Rock that. Mm, mm, like Twenty other tools making the dad noises on his way out. Like this character's weak. <laughs> it just tickled me so much. I thought it was so funny. <laughs> All right. Lock and flip to the... I know that feeling, Akuma. Oh. Yep. Activation time. Finally out of the corner, getting the damage <gasps> out there. But oh, you go with the pros. Corner, oh no! Life. Careful, one more touch, one more tap, just like that. There's a shimmy, the finesse of the bless. Where are you I'm impressed. Joe, the cast for the friendly ghost ain't even here. He's long gone. You didn't see the end of the movie? He done, he's done been gone. Casper's been gone, dog. What are you reaching for? This ain't, a, this ain't ghost. so sad. This ain't no one to hold you. He and Winona Ryder finally became best friends, and then he goes away. The hell's that so, all about? They could have been homies. So, he's still rocking with Mika, though. Mm. No command right. groups. Denial. But here we go. Right, Since I'm getting in some way or another. Oh my god, these dashes. Oh, Pluses. the damage. There's the boss. We got out. DPs up in here. You gotta be careful. Respect your opponent's meter, but activation from Flux. Here it is. The desk go in here, but Ooh, defense on deck. Okay, what's the setup here? Yo, Ooh, V shifts out, v no shift. demon palm. Doesn't punish! Yeah, I've got a I'm DP. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Dash up. Mm. Oh! Oh, yeah, like how you waited and baited, there's a pace. throw, there you go, Joe! Game I'm with, see, I feel like if you would've DP'd at the wrong time, he would've got punished, right? But he just waited, yeah. went for the yeah. simple stuff, and simple stuff will take you far. Set point, Joe Umi Rogan to move on to winner, to loser side, I'm sorry, of grand finals. Nice interrupt there on the fireball. Anti-air gonna try to bust oh, no. out. This is gonna be- No! no! Oh! <laughs> what? That, there was a second for the bits. He... Did he forget? He got a whole bag. He skill just like that. Put him in the corner. And with all that bar at the bottom. He's gotta find a it's way to cook with Flux Wave in big trouble. One more hit yeah. to do for the stun. Oh! Jump in, oh. gets it done, Umi oh. Rogan! Oh. Umi Rogan! Let me see the Umi Rogans in the chat right now. Umi Rogan in the chat right now. Let me see the Umi Rogans in the chat. Three, oh, oh, they said the EX Fireball was nerfed. They said that they said the character was weak. They said he was bottom. They said he was on the bottom. He's a top. He's a top. Damn. Who's cashing in right now? Because there were some points on the oh, line for Flux Rogan Rogan fans. Z's not who we will be said right now. 0.7k <laughs> points? <laughs> Bro. Uh, you make a moat out here. Make a moat. Oh, man. Z's not Making mad moat. Z's not taking it. And you know who else is taking it? Joe Uma Rogan. Moving on lo loser side of things, but still in grand finals for that run back that they had a little bit earlier over in winter side. So it's going to be a good one. Yeah. Battle of the Shotos. Yeah, I've heard. I heard a rumor. Good stuff, though. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I was say I heard a rumor that Dells was a bit of a shuttle player himself. That's all I wanted to say. What were you going to say? He considers himself. I was going to say, if he really considers himself a shuttle player, you know whether or not he does, he's still, you know, still Dell. But also, you guys can still enter. You know, put up that code exclamation mark match arena before we get to the grand finals here of things. This is the grand finals of Digital Havoc Week Forty Eight. Rio Mirror, Ruby Rogan in the loser side versus Dell's on fire in the winner side. Let's get it. Tweet it out. Yo, we got, we got that Rio Mirror. We saw the Ryu switch by Joe Umi Rogan in the last time they played. Uh, in the final round, where Dell's kind of ran rampant, but Uma Rogan's had time to rethink the game plan, think about Dell's style, so we're definitely going to see adaptations here, right? Like, there's no way he doesn't change up his game plan. Here's a 7-frame sweep, though. Dell's looking pretty clean. Yeah, the neutral jump over that. It is just a lot of back and forth right now between the fireballs. Kind of still in the neutral, just slowly chipping away. Yo, Ooh. the jumping light! Okay, sweep activation, gonna come in with this fire. Jumps over the EX. Joe Umarogan gonna get the corner carry in this combo. That buff is so good for Ryu. But now Dells is activating now helicopters it's... out. Oh! Oh! Yeah, he's he's a touch of Hunter got punished. Dell gotta find his own way to you know, confirm on the base. Oh. with the throw though. Umarogan with the first one. Says, hold on now. 
I do play Ryu. I play Ryu, I Ryu, and Root. <laughs> and I'll play you too. Put your hands up. Yo, the Ryu Stooges. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they just smack him on the head, they make different noises. Okay, low 40x and tosses fireballs dashing forward. Yo, the medium kick doing great work. Dell's trying to parry. Nothing doing. Joe Marugan playing Rugen. My mm. goodness. Joe Marugan playing super well Rugen. right now. Super activation. Rugen. <laughs> yeah, still holding on to that V trigger pass. too. But yeah, Dells and Fire trying to get something working. This is the one that one hit the, the to really get something going in terms of oh, pressure, yeah, but that was it. right back at you. Yeah, that V trigger's yeah. double digits minus easy punish for Joe and Morogan. I think it's like yeah. minus twenty two on block after the first activation. Damn. It's mm. mad punishable. It's a lot. Yeah. You, you gotta have the frame you, data. You, you got a second a to go get us. I was gonna say you got a second to go get a snack, come back, and then do the punish. <laughs> Fat take jump a in here. Take a lap around the house. Ooh. What is Delzon doing? Oh my! God. The, who who's playing right now? This ain't this ain't Dells. Hold on now. This ain't Dells. This ain't Dells. This ain't Dells getting pieced up like this. You play this character. You played him for years. You let Umuroki just pee on your spot. My man's marking his territory on him. On your head right now. <laughs> this is your boy. Damn. Yo, the second low forward gets the juggle. Jumping in, yo, but Dells knows the frame data. Challenge is there. Walks oh, out the low forward. Umuroki. Yeah, stuck in the, in the corner. I was say, stuck in the corner though. At, even with the activation, you get V reversal out there. Woo, but that reversal feeling kind of nice. His life points. Look at that. <laughs> My fight what money. life points? Stay out of here. Trying to open him up the cross. cross. Chase down with a cross cut. cut. We've seen him do that with the Kuma. He'll do that with Ryu too. Yeah, the conversion. Big boy damage. If Dells can get a touch, he's okay. But Uma Rogan. Oh! oh Ooh, that was, oh. that was too close, brother, but you get hit with the fireball anyway. Umi Rogan came to play. You know what? I take back what I said before. I said this, this, maybe this wasn't his character. I mean, if you, if you like Ryu like this, you wouldn't be playing the normal costume. You would have bought the extra stuff. You would have had him in the in the B-Boy or something different. But Umi <laughs> Rogan kind of looking unusual out here. And I mean that in the best kind of way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what if Delzon goes to character so I can fix Cammy? Round one. <laughs> Dels, Dels he needs to pick, he needs to pick himself up right here. <laughs> uh, I would like to see him make you up and start playing this this character the right way, because right now it is reset point for Umi Rogan. Yeah, Yo, he gets him the second nice... hit. Yeah, as I say, finally get some damage on the board here. Looking like he's still alive. The man's got a pulse, but can he keep it up? Try and do parries with the fireball and get some small punish. Yo, the whiff punish on the sweep with the EX. Right Activation time. Uh. Yeah, Dell's choosing to use the view reversal <laughs> instead. Lots of parries. Stop it, he says. Neutral oh, jump land no! on the fireball. Ass over tea kettle. Dell's on the board of the round. Oh, that's a little bit heartbreaking. Always to see that, and it's just the come down. Like, not sure if it's gonna quite hit, but that definitely oh. hit. Going in with a forward throw, walk and delves into the corner. Stood out. This is the fireball right after. <laughs> I was trying to take everything back, but it's difficult. Somebody in chat said that Dells is Hadouki. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Hadouki. <laughs> you kind of look like Dookie right here, dog. As Umi Rogan is wiping his shoe off on this dude, seeing it continuously time and time again. It's like that crouching and kicking the fireball, Ooh, chasing oh, down. No. It's almost like Umi Rogan plays his character more than Delzone. Yeah, but Delzone got the, the activation. Got... Ooh. Oh. Speaking of counter hits, Joe Umi Rogan looking to get that reset point right now. This cannot be the fire that we saw before, because this looks like a, a puff, a smoke. This doesn't look like nothing. The weight and the bait, my man throwing it out, Ross in the back, and just like that, Uroga got him caught in the corner. 
is two good conversions for stun. I'm sorry, just one. Yo, look at this, Luke. Oh no. Res Ooh. Uma Rogan resetting stuff. You win. We're going That's to ultimate point. grand finals. We're going to stale bread grand finals. We're going to warm water, hot dog, <laughs> beside a side a side a plain hot dog. No so, butter on the noodles. That's too extra, spicy for me. I was gonna say with an <laughs> extra extra side of uh, dirty feet, having showered in oh. a few months. <laughs> oh, wow. Them, them kind of grand finals. Mm. You said, let me get some seasoning. I got the bunions for you. And people, we also got some great games for you to close out the day. Hey, I ain't into that, but if you play Ryu like this long, you probably, you probably be, never mind. I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna stop. Cause I'm gonna get in trouble. Yo, know, my man's got the go lemon go zester run, running the lemon zester across the toes to get oh, that. Oh, God. Uh, oh, great going on him. Stop it. Got the great going on OG Young coming through with the 16. I see you, dog. Yo, What's good, OG Young? In the Ryu versus Ryu Grand Finals reset point, Joe Louis Rogan has dragged Dell's on fire down to the demons with the dungeon dog, and you see the costume change. He put on the he put on the tracksuit. Costume before? I don't know. But this isn't this tracksuit is an auto power up. It's an auto power up. My man's ready for the Olympics now. He's ready for fraud. He's ready for scam. He's been doping for months. He's ready. Yo, the jump over the fire. All juiced up. Yeah, you know, talk about power up though. Activation time from Joe Morogan getting the damage out there. Nice anti air. Woo! The I'm liking cut. this. Get some low. Double set on the crunch wing kick. Fucking kick. Back throw. EX parry though. Starting to wake up. The eyes are Whoa. open. The crust is off the sides. Look at this man with max range! <laughs> oh, 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 he got did it again! Double down! Bro, he was sitting for If he didn't think I was gonna do it, I'm gonna do it again. Yeah. And of course, too, we want to see Crush. everybody in chat take a guess at who's gonna take it for grand finals. We got them predictions up there. Spend your channel points. You can't take that with you. I like Monopoly well, money outside. Doggy bag? Gotta eat it here. <laughs> If you're gonna buy your way to heaven with channel points, nah dog, you're watching fighting games. You're going to hell, nothing Ooh. will buy you in. Activation, cross cut, dash up. Ooh, oh, big punish. Oh, he's just a sweep. Again. <gasps> oh, Ooh, wow. no. So many drops. Triple dash. Oh, those dashes right there, nothing getting checked. Now you know how it feels. EX Fireball, trying to check some of these dashes, some of these walk-ins too. Oh! Find the pressure dash up. Oh, there you go. There's a fire. It's been ignited. You want to know how both of these players are Ryu mains? They both dashed at the same time, at the same time. <laughs> they grab before the other did. They're like, the hive mind's triggered. They're like, time to dash. <laughs> My dashing <laughs> senses are tingling. It's like a program that's in like three players' minds. It's like they have to like do a dash, like multiple dashes within a few frames yep. of the match. Every time. Or they have like a bad rash, CFN. right? Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Looking like Tyrone Biggs. Your skin just starts to get weird. Yep. <laughs> you got some of those dashes over there? At least, <laughs> at least three times a day, every Ryu main on the planet dashes at the same time. Yo, DPs. Oh, of course. Yeah, they have to. Woo! Going in. Ooh! Okay. The man finally ready, but he gets thrown. And, oh, the ants here. Wow. Yo, he tossed it through it! He activated the tossed Big Brain Academy, okay. Say, hold on now. You thought you could pick up my character like that? And maybe, just maybe, he wanted to give us a reset point so we could see more games and really put Umi Rogan in his place and put through a pace though with a jump in is Umi Rogan. Ooh, Yo, he punished it though. Flow forward. Yeah, this kid can be shit that way, but all right, Delvin Fire ready to put the damage on deck, following up the throw. Great that time. Okay, the universal doesn't want to hold the plus frames. <gasps> he recovered in time. Oh, the Tatsu Brain stopped the roundhouse. No 
Try to finish off the light touch. Yeah. Stop. He's gonna have more than that. Take the Umi Rogan. B reversal. Crush the kick flips out. EX does not connect. B reversal again. Crush the kick, but doesn't do him. You play with them things. I'm like me too. You play with them things. I'm like me too. And speaking of two, that's two. Verdell's on fire. One more. One more game. And he'll take this entire tournament. Damn. Yo, I, I mean, I, is there a statistician in the booth? Is there somebody with stats in the booth? Has Dells ever won Digital Havoc before? Has he ever won Digital Havoc so, before? So and I need to know, thing. has he won it? Go ahead, go ahead. No, go ahead. no, no. So he he was playing in the, he was, when he was qualifying for the G Field uh, tournament that was going on last week, I was in one of the right. stream chats and I told him, like, Dells on, you can win this tournament, but you'll never win a Digital Havoc. And I think this is his this is his F U to me for what I said to him last week. So I mean Bro. He might, I'm not gonna lie, you love to see it and we definitely love to yep. see some more yep. Street Fighter V action going into it, grand finals. But might not be the last match of the night. Joe Umarokin could take it back. He did get the reset, so he's not fully down now for the count yet. Bring in the Akuma. We need to change it. Yeah, it's it's a Now, Dells did beat Joe Morogan's Akuma. I mean, Akuma's going to do better here, right? But I, I just, I don't know. I, I think Dells has so used in the to bag. I think forcing the switch this late, he's ready. Yeah, he's used to this matchup. Yeah, look at that, see? Dash him right on her. That's big damage. Oh, interesting. And Z's Nest says Akuma does worse in this matchup. All right, fair enough. Yo! No overheads. Ooh. Mere Ooh. Oh, my God. Oh, come on, come on, bro. Just, oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Well, he's guard broken. He's guard broken. Yeah, he, he, yeah he's crushed. He's crushed. He's crushed. Yeah, fine. Damn. I love knocking <laughs> Joe Umarogan's fan base in the chat. Go from like one yeah. side to the other. Like Joe's the best to Joe's the worst. Y'all are the greatest. <laughs> Yo, no demon play. Some real fans, though. <laughs> Bad sweep. Good fun. Yeah, I love him. Finally yeah, see that air fireball connect, time. though. Yeah. For once, yeah, that's true. Those... Flex this. I was gonna say the difficult thing though is nice Akuma has right such here. low health. He cannot afford to take a yeah, lot of he hits can't here. Hold too much. Ooh. Oh, oh, he didn't get out. He tried to activate the TP right through. Only Rogan got him caught up in the corner right here. Throwing up the fireballs, got a lot of bar to work with. How you gonna cook? Crouch and kick connects. One more hit will do it. And Yo, Fire with the dash I, up tech, I can't oh, believe it, but the jump in light, Fire will be your we winner with the for this again? week's Digital Havoc. And that will give a big F you to Mufasa. <laughs> but I said, I'm gonna do it, and I get this done. I get it done. Get got. Hold that. Get got, Mufasa. Hold that. Get got, Mufasa. Do that, Dose on Fire. Dose on Fire is the greatest. Hold that. Damn. You have to hold that. <laughs> Gonna hold that. Yeah, good stuff. <laughs> Yo, where the where the Umi Rogan fans in the chat? Y'all gonna switch over? Cause now I'm a Dell. I, I hate to say it, but I'm a Dell fan right here. When he switched mm. over to Ryu and started playing with the character again, when he plays seriously, he's really damn good. In the mm -hmm. his risk reward decisions really? in a lot of these matches, not only in the one that we just saw before, but in the ones previous, have been absolutely money and has led him to this victory. Finally, getting him a win in Digital Havoc and proving Mufasa wrong. Sorry, brother. <laughs> and if you, I was gonna say, see, I like, think I might good... need to change. I was gonna say, I, I might need to Guys, change watch. my Mulan so part of the song because it's like, instead of bringing me daughters when I ask for Delzon, just saying, yep. you gotta, gotta yeah. switch up because yep. Delzon brought it tonight, mm. pulling through, winning grand finals. What mm. were you gonna say, Tom? Mm. I, I was gonna say, like, if you want to watch, like adaptation and changing of play styles you should watch that grand finals again right because if you think about it yeah. like rogan ran 3-0 over dells mode over dells and after that dell said mm -hmm. okay i see you i see your play style and i see what you're doing with this ryu and i'm gonna absolutely counter pick and counter play the hell out of you and he did exactly that right pushing joe rogan to mm -hmm. making joe switch to the akum leading it shut him down shut down his ideas shut down his offense it was awesome that was a great set that was a great grand finals for a Thursday night.